Yeah. I'm excited for this. We have a lot of custom hats for the next upcoming kingdoms. And they're all fun. Like, there's not a bad kingdom in this game. First playthrough, this will be, like, my third. So, I think I put that in the, in the objective panel. I don't remember. But, uh, for the record, in case anyone asks, it's my third playthrough. First two being a long time ago, though. So, <laughs> Nipple Mario again? Yes. Got some time to kill. Uh, we don't need that. We'll just be going off to it. Awesome. <laughs> Fake Viv. Collecting hats. Yeah, all the outfits too in the game. Look at the Seaside Kingdom. Boob Lane. Some nice sparkling water. It's peaceful. The glass is half empty. No, an octopus. <laughs> He's just strong it all down. Damn. He's inflating from all the water. But with a new kingdom means uh, we gotta wear the appropriate hat. And for this one, there's not really a better one than just a nice beach bucket hat. So <laughs> there we go. Have to enjoy our day at the beach and uh, just have a chill time. Boosh. <laughs> Wait, I gotta fix the string. That's fine. Okay. Yes. I like this hat too. We wore it for uh, the Lake Kingdom too, but it's more fitting for this. Oh, hello, snail. <laughs> They're an artist. The plane needs to be a beautiful resort until the creature showed up. What? <laughs> yeah, sparkling water. Okay. <laughs> the dude's just hopping over there. Where did he go? I don't know. Let's take the Eva. Yeah, a lot of calming islands, and there's a really great underwater just though. <laughs> it's so cool to see. I appreciate the calming beach vibes. Yeah, welcome everyone to tuning in. We're just starting off, and uh, yeah, having some fun in Seaside. <laughs> uh, first stream, welcome. Oh, sorry to say people are tuning in. Just uh, gotta run around and have some fun. Oh no, coins. Yes. <laughs> gotta style in the coins. Okay, hopefully the volume is up so good. And then yes. <laughs> oh. Still random little question blocks and whatnot. Which is always fun. Ah. <laughs> Crabs. Love this game because everything is interactable. So it just there's always kind of something to do or putts with. Which makes it fun. Go to the water. Yeah. Down with the leaf people. Or the coins rubber. Yeah, you know, they're just bouncing around in the stack. Submerged. Fatal upon touch. Pipes. Underwater maze. Wait, before we do anything, we gotta change outfits. <laughs> just realized that running around is, uh... Hatmeister here will uh, not be best for us. <laughs> Hi. Oh, this guy's cool. Oh, that's not. Water jets. Yeah. <laughs> so our shoes won't get sandy. This place is fun. Game is not completed unless you backwards the long jump. Oh, man. Old tech. Okay, let's, uh, could go floaty, but I, I, I kind of prefer nipple Mario. Sorry. This is perfect. <laughs> Haven't played this game in ages. It kind of loses replay factor after a few playthroughs. Yeah, I can see that after a few. Um, but the main thing that, well, I can invite anyone back to a game is just time, honestly. So for a game like this, like I played it twice and I had a lot of fun, but I haven't touched it for years. And that's why I'm having a lot of fun again. So it's like if a game has less replay value, but you do want to play it again, just, you know, simply avoiding it for a few years and coming back, uh, it creates a really fun new experience. So that's how I feel. It feels like a lot of stuff feels like fresh in a way, because it's like, was nowhere near the top of my mind, which is nice, especially for a fun game like this. <laughs> Prefer nipple croton. No, thank you. Um, 
<laughs> Made a joke on that last time. I'm like, for Beach Kingdom, nah. We'll let Mario uh, would be the shirtless one here. <laughs> I do not have that sort of confidence or uh, <laughs> whatever else the war could be. So can we get up here? I think we might need that ability. Well, on more to the beach. Keep. Keep, keep, keep. What? No volleyball. The nuts here. Nice. <laughs> beach house. These callings are just so nice. Yep, can't do that yet. Oh, hello. It's a shop. <laughs> On a dinosaur. That's how you know it's special. We'll buy the moon. <laughs> It'll be our first one. Oh, these kingdoms are so fun to just immerse myself in. Blue Blaine shopping. Forgot how pretty the game is. It is. It's just very nice. It's a good time. Okay, yeah, we'll need the thingies for that. That we were writing earlier. Also, this looks like it harbors a secret. No? Here. Oh, wait. I see a shadow. I do. Those are purple coins. Yeah, we need those uh, thingies. Uh, what are they called? Like the, th the things with the water sprouts. We'll call them gushies for now. Maybe like gushins or something. Okay. You want to sell someone make it up there? I, I wonder how. Oh, hello. Shells, and there's a hundred. Got a big kingdom. And lots of plants. Okay. Even for a beginning area, it's very fun. We'll come back to you, Rocket. Wait, maybe not. Maybe... Uh, me being indecisive. Let's do, let's do the Rocket. Purple shells. Okay. We have to get our first actual moon today. Woo! I like the little platforming challenges. And that clears the thingies. You go like that. Nice. Oh, ghost coins. <laughs> I love how the platform like bends around you. Nice. Hop down. <laughs> Missing all of them. Nice. Okay, then we gotta find the path, don't we? Oh, they come back. Is there anything important? I feel like there's gonna be like a secret little splinter here, pathway. And this might be it, which isn't much of a secret. Okay. Oh, down throw. Ooh. <laughs> down throw is actually coming in handy. Oh, for a chest. Nice. <laughs> but no Tears of the Kingdom will be optimized when we're at 60 FPS. Oh yeah, for sure. Seeing a Zelda game at 60 FPS. I mean, a Skyward Sword HD was 60 and Link's Awakening. <laughs> but seeing like a Breath of the Wild style game and that would be very weird. <laughs> nice hat, thank you. <laughs> Sorry, focus the second guard on this challenge. And being nimble and quick. <laughs> yeah, I like this area. We got the secret moon, so we're all good there. Nice. Waiting in the cloud sea. Let us go up. Frame rate in Breath of the Wild Forest, 10. <laughs> this is probably like best looking performing Switch game. I can honestly agree with that. It looks very good. Just how well it's detailed and uh it looks ahead of its time even still five years later but yeah um it's been over five years now because its anniversary was october 27th <laughs> i like that There's a million areas to go at once but i choose one of these guys because i want to get that stuff on the shoreline first Oh, it's gonna try to spit at me. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> that one does like a uh, stream around. 
directional attack. Upwards into the sky. <laughs> nice. There's one there. Okay. Water to recharge. Nice. Oh, moon. If I could get up there without the thing, that'd be very funny. Also, coins. Spit around. Nice. <laughs> there for a reason. I didn't see a cat Mario. Nice. Mario Sunshine and Odyssey. Who needs Delfino here when you got Bublane? Welcome to everyone tuning in, by the way. <laughs> yes, just getting some uh, starting stuff here. Okay. Now we'll do this. Oh, that's a special door. I'll do that next. Uh, Cause first I saw this. This takes the cake. I wonder if we can break the things. Can we? Oh, we can. Nice. Wait. Yeah! <laughs> Just get on that level and spit around. Cool. The more purple coins we get, the closer we are to a nice outfit. <laughs> Speaking of which... Oh, wait. <laughs> Just have to cool down. There you are. <laughs> I saw him under there. Crafty. What? <laughs> Were we just a minute too late? It, it like went away. Oh, that's upsetting. My hat was like there, but <laughs> what can you do? Take it. Just seeing all the things we can collect everywhere, it's like, uh... <laughs> Constantly wanting to veer my brain off course. Options. Wait, can we bounce on the... Yeah, just barely. Oh, and we're out. <laughs> we're a little squid now. Squid Mario. <laughs> you know, I kind of prefer this. We can hop around. We have our own moves. <laughs> if we shake it, we can literally go faster for some reason. <laughs> Level shaking does everything. Scaring the snails. We are the predator. <sighs> mm, meat. Meat, meat, meat. Okay. Back to power mode. This is your favorite world? I love this one. Spit up. Oh, I can't spit open the door. Hats only. Oh. Cool, this one guy. Silly squid. Is there stuff behind us? Splatoon, be like, yes. <laughs> Splatoon in the air. Very high up. This is like Splatoon single player mode. Uh oh. Ooh, that was close. <laughs> Using Joy Cons? Yeah. Uh, it's like the one Switch game I prefer Joy Cons for. Because uh, there's a lot of like uh, certain moves with your hat throws you can do that you can't do on Pro Controller or handheld. Uh, or at least not as easily. And a lot of stuff uses motion controls, uh, which it's not as nice to shake around a pro controller compared to just a right Joy-Con, so. Yeah, I couldn't imagine playing this game with a pro controller. Ooh. Wait, we're so close. Ah, wait. No! No! <laughs> that's fine. Okay, so that's a special challenge at the end. Gotta use it to its limit. Fly through the narrow valley. Oh. Round two. It starts us right back there. Yeah, if you don't know what one's coming up, uh, it's kind of hard. Favorite world's in uh, New Donk City, because the music festival. Yeah, love that. Yo, yeah, what's everyone's favorite world? So got New Donk City one, uh, one for Bowser's Kingdom, Seaside. Very rarely one of the small worlds will be someone's favorite. Like, I know Platinum likes the, uh, the Lost Kingdom a lot. <laughs> yeah, best game to play Joy-Cons easily. <laughs> We're just gonna take a straight shot, because I need all the gas I can get. 
Nice. Oh, that wasn't that bad, actually. I missed the coins purposely, but... Oh, <laughs> sorry, Squiddy. Trust in the narrow valley obtained. Then we just have to make it. Wait, right in the pipe. Right in the pipe. Come on. Yes, okay. <laughs> nice. Wasn't a ground pound in, but uh, still a careful descent. Mushrooms fun. Hack Kingdom's your favorite. I love Hack Kingdom. Yeah, just it's very spooky, uh, avant-garde, uh, <laughs> mysterious. I don't know. It's like, what words can describe Hack Kingdom? It's just <laughs> Hack Kingdom. I love it. Such a unique visual style. Oh, <laughs> went up and down. There's a bunch of coins. Is there a cheap cheap or? Yep, there you are. Use this to swim around a bit. And the gusher's walking makes weird sounds. Yeah, it's very squishy. I'm telling you, it's just Splatoon, but Sky Ink. Viv imposter, I know. <laughs> the real Viv is probably eating chicken nuggets right now, so <laughs> we may never know. Nice, I like getting all the coins. Although this outfit does work, I do want to get one of the special ones. Those are very nice. <laughs> so cool to swim around. Oh wait, tunnel. Yeah. Oh, and that's it. Underwater highway tunnel. <laughs> it's a fishy highway. They got their own traffic. And coins too. Ow. <laughs> We're just a second too late. Another door. Wait, can we break this one? No. Specifically the hat, as it says. Oh. Hey. Get back here, Moon. You thought it could fool me? Wriggling on the sandy bottom. This looks like a fish tank aquarium. Like the front's the glass and we're just like swimming in it. Yeah. We are the fish now. Uh-oh. Get out, Mario. Can't be the fish without our cheap cheap. Favorite kingdoms, yeah. I, I think I made it clear uh, that New Donk is my favorite, but I love this kingdom a lot. Just how peaceful it is. We have to get going, anyways. <laughs> um, I don't know. I'm kind of enjoying just getting everything, though. Oh, wait. Until then, let's get these purples. Spin around. Nice. <laughs> Just kills everything in sight. Oh, I might need some oxygen. I see purple dragon. Dory. Oh, there's a moon under that one. Purple moon for purple. I know. It's just so massive, like, under the water. <laughs> Sphinx. Okay, wait. Where'd he go? I need to live. Ah! Okay, God, I was like, ah, mercy, Dory. <laughs> oh, yeah, and then let's get our thingies. There's 21, that should be enough, because usually the first outfit's like 15. So, not that bad. Ah. <gasps> I feel like I might need this outfit, though. Resort's cool, but I really want the sailor outfit. Okay, you know what? Because I like shirtless nipple Mario, we're gonna stay with him for now, and we're gonna save it for Sailor, because I like Sailor a lot. But we could just wear this for now. No, okay, how about that? <laughs> how about this? Buy resource, then Sailor, then we'll focus on souvenirs. Sorry, I like the Sailor one a lot. I think it's funny. Because, like... Yeah. <laughs> Me changing my mind every five milliseconds. Uh... <laughs> That's fine. It's only 45. We're like 
39 coins away. <laughs> See, it looks nice. Oh, he's got the straw hat. He was ready to beach, but... Oh, wow! <laughs> Lava's not on the beaches. What? <laughs> That's a bad resort. Hey! Okay, now no can kill my water. I thought that would have helped the lava. I'm Luffy from One Piece. <laughs> but is the One Piece real? Is that the One Piece? Well, it's One Piece to help me out. Okay. Not Luffy, we're fishy. Till we get much higher. <laughs> Okay, let's do that main... Oh, wait, never mind. Uh, <laughs> we need the main quest when you see a fishy hole. Oh, oh my. You mean I could... Oh, no. Hey. We need those. Don't worry, if we get the other uh, outfit, we'll be another anime character soon. Everything's an anime reference. Wait, no, another, another hole. <laughs> There's just so many ways to go. My segmented brain, that's just very, uh, all over the place is so happy. <laughs> Wish. Oh, boinking. Uh, here we go. Okay, now we'll go through the sea of uh, hazardous leaf. Damn, why are the plants so violent? Just mind your own business. <laughs> We're just creating our own cyclone down here. Okay. Where do you have all the required moons? It's so easy. Glass palace treasure. There we go. At least this way we're getting tons of these coins. Okay, now let's pursue the main story. Which is... Everywhere. Okay. <laughs> Everywhere but where we went, honestly. Which is fine. They don't want to talk to a fishy. Darn. Okay. Uh, they could create sparkle water. Okay. Yeah, happiness is good. Ground pound. No. Okay, um, how do we get up there? Ooh, the lighthouse thingy. Also, I like doing the main stuff because then the music comes back. The music is like very faint right now, but if we did more, well, it'll be more apparent. Wonder if we did this first. Yes, make it to the island. Come on. Woo! Nice. Okay, good. <laughs> that was a two in one way to get over. Neat. <laughs> Wind bomb. <laughs> well, how about fire legs? That's better. Oh, purples. Yup, into the house. That's a lame house. Ah, uh, okay. Never mind. No high stakes. Oh, further ahead. They're acting like this is an obstacle for me. Nice, okay. Just down there. I can dive. This tunnel's quite long, only a fish can make it through. What the heck? <laughs> Did all that for nothing. Nah, there's fishies over here. Come here, fish. Come here. Oh! Nice. Okay, and then next we'll just pop up here. Yeah. <laughs> 
Oh, just to fake us out. Now here's the real fun. Oh, wait, nope. <laughs> okay, God. <laughs> It'll pop out. Scaring all the Snellies. Is there a fish hat in Odyssey? There is not. What? <laughs> we just went down here and it just kicks us all the fish anyways. At least there's two more conveniently patrolling? What sort of patrol? The moon? No? Okay. I do like the ambient cave though. I'm a fan of that. Whoa! <laughs> Eel warm. No thanks. Mario 64 flashbacks. <laughs> Poisonous, freakish eels. Ooh. The marine music. Okay, we're doing good on the coins. We've been getting them like extra fast this playthrough. Like me not even remember where they are, just like checking all the right nooks and crannies. Looking for like a hidden moon, which may possibly exist. Maybe not though. There was the coins. I feel like we got what we needed. Drawers mass flashbacks too. Yeah, the giant eels. And Snow Kingdom. Uh, yeah, we did that last stream. I stole those vods up. Lighthouse. Yeah. <laughs> First mini objective: the lighthouse sea. Okay. <laughs> Campaign anyone? Ow. <laughs> Get enough celebration. <laughs> I'll never surrender the delicious sparkle water. Oh. You're the source of the lava. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> Might have been the harder of the bunch. Oh. There they are. No. He's polluting the sea. Have you learned anything in school? They have schools, right? Yeah, fish swim in schools. <laughs> also, it was a nice dive. You know what's is nice though? Maybe learning a bit more about the land itself. With the brochure. Blue Blaine, the relaxing resorts by the carbonated sea. Population middling, size wide, locals bublanians, <laughs> such a funny one. The currency shell shaped, industry bubbly water and tourism. Temperature average 88. <laughs> it's so warm in like almost all these uh, little regions of the planet. Behold the power of carbonation, a miraculous mixture. The four fountains in bublane spray seawater towards the glass tower. The ocean here is carbonated but otherwise unremarkable. However, when blended in the glass tower, it takes on a deep elegance flavor and becomes sparkle water. <laughs> That's neat. This treasure beverage is said to bring good fortune, happiness, and even romance to those who drink it, which has led it to being featured in many wedding ceremonies. <laughs> Raise a glass. The spectacle known as glass tower isn't just majestic, it also fulfills the critical role of manufacturing the famous local product sp sparkle water. Yeah. <laughs> Stands atop the glass palace, which has a uniquely beautiful architectural style. It's a treasure to be explored. <laughs> we got a section on uh, nature's fire hoses. Well, except a fatal version. These unusual creatures collect seawater constantly. They use this water both to defend themselves and to prepare themselves. Sometimes straight up. I like those guys a lot. It didn't say their name, though. We were talking about that earlier. They're like Gushin. I don't know. <laughs> Gushy. A love nest for eels. <laughs> Just that chompy face. He looks like a, a kitten that hasn't eaten in two hours. <laughs> like, <laughs> straight V. In addition to the fun resort spots, fun in Bublane, there are some notably dangerous locations as well. One of these is the underwater cave connected to the lighthouse where gigantic creatures called Ma Rays make their nests and shoot off their long bodies in response to stimuli. A little caution can go a long way when exploring this place. In nature's hot tub, we didn't see that. Ways away from the beach sits an outdoor bath fed by a natural hot spring. V 
Featuring ocean views, it has become quite popular with tourists. The spring was formed by volcanic activity in the ocean floor, which we're aware of, uh, <laughs> and it's said to have numerous medicinal effects. Take one dip and we're sure you'll fall for its charms. It's also a lovely natural reprieve from the modern resort developments. Yeah. <laughs> We'll have to go back there and not burn in lava this time. Relaxing competition. When in Bublain, be sure to enjoy a game of beach volleyball on the local court. We'll have to do that soon. The on-site coach gives a strong guidance, even for beginners. As they say around here, let's a play. <laughs> okay. And yeah, we can do all that. Um, Gushian? Or Gushan? Okay. Thank you. Boy, <laughs> we. Okay. Do that again. Keep going. Yeah, many. Keep it up. Keep it up. Oh, get most of the coins. Can't get them all. Those aren't things. Those are birds. <laughs> I thought those were flowers. Nope, don't spit. Cute. Okay, now. Spin. Oh, wait. No, it's a straight across. Oh. It's the most convenient way of doing it. Wait, I have a way. Go like that, and then spin around. Nice! Oh, that was really the best way. Ooh. I love that. Self-defense circle. I scared the birds. I know, they were just vibing. Go like that. Little clap, and then... Whoosh! <laughs> oh, it is water. It was just residing on top. Nice and warm, yeah. Maybe it's because of the lava surrounding it. It's probably heating it up nice. I scared the pigeons. I'm the true monster here. Okay, there we go. Like that. Spin around. Ooh. Fast clearing. It's like a water vacuum. Wait, no. There we go, like that. Yeah. So satisfying. Ooh. <laughs> Clean up the litter here. We're making up for all the oct octopuses' uh, detriments to this world. Love on water, I can't. <laughs> Hot spring seal. The polluted octopus is French. Okay. <laughs> so many French things. I mean, that's gonna be like every Nintendo game. Um, what was that thingy? There was a purple coin. Sorry, I, I saw him and then I got sidetracked. Did we get him? I don't even remember. We're so busy clearing the sea. Oh, there's a nut. Oh, ow! Again, against nature, I see. In your evil ways. Hmm. Oh. Okay. Okay, let's take that to the, uh... What was that? The, the resort thingy? We can swim with this. I don't know if there's a faster way at all. We're using it as a floaty. I love that. Oh, I see more uh, coins. We're, we're getting everything as we go. Also, we're so close. I think we're uh, two away from getting the outfit that we want. I really want that. We haven't even explored a lot of this, so... We're like clearing off purple coins everywhere. <laughs> no more coins for the leaf. Oh, I see some more there. Well, we'll get back soon. Oh. Wait. Oh, more coins. Uh, This first. And then nut. Wait. Hey, no, no, no. Don't take my nut. Okay. That's there. Good. After this, we'll get our outfit. Okay. More smoke! Wow, hi. Danger coral. Ah. Captain Goomba. Thought I took care of you in the last game. Okay. Keep. Throw. Long jump. Fast. Take. Oh, take. Throw. 
Not in the water. <laughs> yeah, we're good. It's just semi annoying. But I like how it acts as a floaty. It's a neat feature for sure. And then Thorchar! Wait, don't tell me that got it. That actually worked? Wait. <laughs> what a trick shot. Okay. Nice. <laughs> Sorry, that was cool. <laughs> Nuts trick shots. Oh, what? There's a heart in the barrel. Oh. Well, how neat. <laughs> A barrel of love. Was someone modded Breath of the Wild in the Odyssey? I, I think I've seen that before. Or like, I don't know. Some people pulling some sort of... I think like... I don't know. I, I've seen it somewhere. That'll be funny. <laughs> Make Breath of the Wild a platformer or Mario an open world adventure game. Ah! You know, where's those uh, fast flowers? Or rather, yeah, I don't mind which one we do. Ooh, nice. <laughs> Let's uh, meet up with Dory first. And a lot of hearts. I wonder if that's when this thing's breaking. Probably. <laughs> Only viable explanation. Last palace. King heart. Oh yeah, they're bomb rocks. Okay. I thought I would ever die from that. Oh, there's more? What the? Why is there just so many purple coins everywhere? We're gonna find them all without even, like, deliberately looking. Oh. Welcome aboard. Uh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we have to get the sailor outfit. <laughs> yes. Just buy it. The full gappy look. And, uh, change now. Yeah! <laughs> we are now Sailor Mario. Yet another anime reference. To like every anime. Ow. Woo. Okay. Yay. Rock, paper, scissors again? Oh yeah, I forgot about that. How he makes the different hand symbols when you get a moon. Maybe not right away. <laughs> Always I think too hard about it. <laughs> Bye. Bye. The ultimate weapon. Also, I love how every kingdom has like very exclusive uh, things to capture too. Like these guys you can only find in mood lane. It's very cool. At least in like the main overworld. Or like so somewhere like Universal, which I like, like Cheap Cheeps. Okay. Something tells me I gotta get a stack of these Goombas. All right, Captain. <laughs> Look at me. I am the captain now. <laughs> Same goes to you. So if we steal the hat. Yeah. Pluck it off. And then high jump. Oop. Oh, wait. Ow. My temporary. Wait. Stop. 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 <laughs> ah! I'm going to need some normal jump. There's like a normal jump if you press the button or a high jump if you shake it. High jump's less precise, though, and that's all I was trying to do. I wonder if this is... Nah. We'll come back to that. Okay. <laughs> Alright, dodge the chestnuts here. Easily. Oh! <gasps> it's... It's the Sun Hat Goomba! Wait! It's me! Yeah! Yeah! Hey! How do you do? <laughs> See, we're wearing the same outfit today. I'm a little less pink, though. Love by the seaside. How cute. <laughs> Whoa. Oh! Ow! <laughs> what happened? I don't know. Not me, so not my problem. Okay, let's go here. These coins must be good. Oh, no! Get away! Get away! Woo! <laughs> nice. Can we just jump off here as the Goombas? We might, actually. Yeah! Something tells me you could take a Gushin up here, too. With the water checkpoints. Alright. 
Hmm. Oh, it stopped spouting. Will it start again? One may never know. Oh yeah, there we go. <laughs> I wish I could stay spawn those and just slam it back at those crates. Okay, into my hole. Yeah, goodbye. Sorry, Goombas. Wait, actually, if you really want to come with, I can't deny you. Yeah. Above Rolling Canyon. Yeah. <laughs> Sailor Moon gets another moon. <laughs> and then another. <laughs> that is the third. Yeah, hey, we'll take a gushing up at some point. Excellent. Wait, two fountains to. We forgot to push that button. Uh, I, was, I was like, wait a second, two? Don't invalidate my hard work. Can we wall jump off that? Something tells me we possibly could. I don't know, I gotta see some like crazy speedrunner do it first. Just to believe it myself. Yeah, we're gonna take a gushing up now. Oh wait, no. Main story first, because I really want the place to be restored. Because it undergoes a very fun re renovation. You know, with getting all these purple coins though, maybe think. Is there like a purple coin percent uh, for like Mario Odyssey speedruns? Like, I'm sure it's like different things like the moons, or, like being the story. But, like, is there just like a speedrun category where it's get all 50 purple coins or... Just all per kingdom, rather? I wonder if that's a thing. You may never know. Also, I think we're just going up there for one of them. <laughs> We didn't do the easy one yet. You gotta go? Okay, have a good one. Sure there is, but 100% of the speed run, that's fair. I don't know, just like all purple coins, because I guess what makes that cool is that, uh, unlike the moons, which constantly get added to the kingdom after, like, story checkpoints, like, oh, there's only so many when you first go to a kingdom, and then more get added after you beat the main quest there, and then more in the post game. With purple coins, like they're all there, I'm pretty sure, from the beginning. So I feel like that could make an interesting speedrun category if it isn't already. It probably is, it's probably not a big one. I don't know. I just like stuff like that. <laughs> it has to be different, you know? Also let's ride that up. I feel like it will not end well for us, but Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Never mind. Pressure low. Weakling. Taking that. Yep. Ooh, wow. Dodging around the bombs. That was an Incredibles moment. Ooh. Ow. <laughs> First live on Twitch, welcome. <laughs> Nipple percent, oh no. Hey, we just gotta get this last one and then we're uh, pretty good, honestly. Okay. <laughs> and that's what we like to see. All right, Octo. <laughs> Seems like he's he's the boss we gotta take down. You think he can hit me with that? He's so far. Weak. <laughs> Auto range. Don't even try. Your intimidation means nothing. Oh, wait, the pressure's back, right? We can can we use it. What? <laughs> okay, we need uh Gushy. Take him. Yeah. Okay. Now let's melt this lava head. <laughs> Skating. Up high. Okay. Get close. As long as we're in the water, we won't drain our personal water. Woo. Nice. Drain his head. <laughs> yeah. Boink. <laughs> 
more bombs. Okay. I think this is a hard fight in any way. I guess his head's weak now. And catch up before our water goes away, which it might. Ow. <laughs> now nah, he was just too fast. We have to wait for him to be uh, slow. Wait, what? <laughs> You're stuck. Um. Okay, while well, he's queuing up a, a ball, he does the slowest, it looks like. We'll wait for that. We're gonna get a little scared. And then, come on. Yes, okay. Oh, crash. Nice. <laughs> now we do it. Cool. As long as we get the high ground on him. Oh, <laughs> look at the side ground on me. So we're getting a lot of side coins just by doing random stuff. Oh, turnips. <laughs> <There's> another. <laughs> Okay, keep another one. As soon as he queues up the next one, we'll uh, we'll take a gun at it. And crash! Yes! Okay, right in the forehead. Splatoon 3 DLC boss, bye-bye. <laughs> oh. There we go. Hats off to you. Or, hats on. <laughs> Not taking it off. Pretty. And there, the sparkle water is restored. And their industry is back on business. Yeah. Splatoon is over. Yeah. <laughs> we did it. The glass is half full. Yeah. No more empty. <laughs> okay. Well, I like messing around this. Oh, we can do the, the beach volleyball now. Technically. Yeah. What a pretty sunset. Oh, well. It's so nice. There's like a rainbow in the back. I mean, we can. But I kind of like this Mario a lot. Okay. Let's see. Looking for power moons, yeah. But volleyball. Wait. Park barrel, yeah. <laughs> Now that I know it exists. Chill in the park? Yeah. I like volleyball. There we go. <laughs> Second leeway time. Whoop. <laughs> Getting tricky with that. Okay. <laughs> you can do anything you want to hit it. A little head bump. As long as you watch that shadow, you're pretty good. It speeds up more and more. It's so slow, it's easy to mess up at the beginning. <laughs> Wait, like, just like that, actually. <laughs> yeah, I hate the first couple so much. Okay. As long as we get to 10, it's actually at a normal speed that abides slightly more by a uh, normal gravity in physics. This is really slow. That would keep my momentum up. That's like one big thing. Uh, so there's a constantly running too. It helps with the momentum. So you're not just starting off the sprint slow. Then you miss. Just gonna tire out his lungs. Better him than me. Let's see how far we can gun this. <laughs> the hardest moon. I want to say that, but uh, well, I have something to show after this, so. I can see for most people how it's the hardest. <laughs> nice. Only 15? How many for the next? Well, I guess we'll try to get them both. Ah, what? <laughs> okay. Well, we got the first one at least. Because, uh... Think about this game, I used to be very, very close. And like, mind you, this was like a year after the game came out to uh, a top 1,000 in the world. Like I was like, 
it must have been like 1200th place or something like that um but probably since as i heard so many hackers ruin the leaderboards of these games uh but I, i'm not actually sure so back in like yeah mid to late 2018 i was like almost top a thousand in the world let's see what we are it was like what 600 something um oh i didn't really lose my rank much at all did i <gasps> yeah with 489 uh i am 1700th place in the world okay i thought i would be like past like 10,000 or something like People exploited the game, but I barely even lost half of my... <laughs> wow, okay. No, I, I take pride in this one, because this is my best uh, minigame out of all of them. Uh, jump rope, yeah, this one doesn't count, because hackers. Uh, RC, pretty good. Almost top 10,000. And this one I didn't really try. Uh, well, as hard, you know. As What I mean by that, a skill issue, but uh, <laughs> it's fine. But how I got this one is... Uh, it's a bit of a story. Because if you start playing in two-player mode, we need one person to be Mario and the other to be Cappy. And you just kind of move around that. Because this is a lot easier than worrying about Mario. Uh, because my hat just moves around perfectly to my analog stick. There's no momentum increases or decreases. It's a very big hitbox. And uh, that's how I was able to get like almost 500. And it, I don't know how long it took. It was probably like 20 minutes of just constant looking at this because it gets faster and faster. Um, I just couldn't, I didn't have the endurance. Keep going. I'm not sure what uh, the second one is. It's probably like 50. Does it sound right? Which, yeah, it's slow right now, whatever. Uh, hop around. Yeah, I can just snap to wherever, like, so easy. Kind of follow the shadow. And if it hits the sand for, like, a second, like, you're good. Woo! Like that. Okay, one second. I'm going to move Mario out of the way just very carefully while I do this. Okay, a little too far. I just didn't want to accidentally bump into him and like recall my hat. Wow, that was close. That was so close. It's 100 for this? Oh no. I thought it was 100 for jump rope. Okay, I can see why it's the hardest moon then if you don't know about this. <laughs> but at the, the bottom of the volleyball leaderboard. I mean, there's so many people have probably only gotten one just because they like tried the minigame and then didn't actually try to play it after the first go. So that's probably the true bottom. Jeez. I don't know how you can get close to 500 again. We're not going to try for that, but we'll just keep going this first time. Whatever happens, happens. Satisfying. So satisfying. Okay. 49. 50. Oh, yeah, that's not even the moon. Okay, yeah, this definitely is the hardest moon in the game. I, it's been so many years, I don't even remember. How did I put up with this so long? I already. <laughs> My body's already starting to bag out here. <laughs> not, I mean, not fully. Like, I, I feel that way. I don't have that sort of uh, sweaty gamer endurance that I need right now. Oh my god. Jeez. Like, it's not that bad, it's just the fact that it's so like, just don't, don't, don't. Like, I don't like that, man. <laughs> Messing up my uh, everything. Oh my god, it's only 70? My hands are so sweaty now. <laughs> I hate this. <gasps> As long as we get 100. As long as we get 100. Anything else can happen, and it's like, chill. For me, personally, I hate the jump rope more. Like, I mean, this goes slower than the jump rope, so if you fail, it's like, it's just really sucky. 
See, we're only at 91 right now. I went to literally almost 500 at one point. How did I do that? Not that the hardest, it just requires endurance and easy to screw up. If you just have one faulty go. Hand-eye coordination's been increasing. Okay. <laughs> well, there's the moon. Uh, I'm just going to keep going until I stop because it'd be stupid to just end by baking out and just quitting purposely. I doubt we're going to get, like, anywhere close, though. I'll take a break at 200, though, if we get that far. <laughs> and for the haul, because I probably will never try this game again like this. So. I wonder what the world record actually is, though. I don't think I can go that high, but if I look it up, I'll probably see it. What do you think the world record is, guys? <laughs> actually, can someone look that up? <laughs> if that isn't an issue. Okay, now I just got into the rhythm and just 20 flew by. Okay, awesome. <laughs> I don't know why I'm doing this to myself. The moons are just chilling. 9999? Oh, okay. Hacker. <laughs> What's the highest that is at all nines? If that's possible. It's funny that there's hackers in this, but I'm still like in top 2000. That's. Sorry if my ego seems really big about that. I'm just very proud to be in that high ranking of a game that I like this much. Can't tell if this is sad or impressive. It's it's more sad. I'm gonna I'm gonna be honest. But I'll take the per, the percentage of it uh, impressive though that I can. I feel like it's speeding up, but it's not. It just... My perception is a little screwed up now. <sighs> okay. This will be the last time I ever attempt this game. So... <gasps> I, I just... It, it, it's, it's so... It's so... It's so... It's so... We're at 173 already? That's insane. Okay. I'm like focusing, but I, if I focus too hard, I'll screw up. But if I don't focus enough, I'll screw up. Uh, and if I really, really focus, I'll go insane, which I don't want that. The world record is 5,100 legit. That's very believable and actually, wow. That, that, that's awesome, actually. <laughs> I'm gonna die, I know. <laughs> Not before my hands, uh, <laughs> and my eyes. Jeez. Part of me wants to get out of this place after this game, because I'm ready, like... <laughs> dun, 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 dun. <laughs> oh! Hey, clapping! That's encouragement, guys. I mean, we have to keep going, because the game's encouraging us to break ourselves. We're getting 200! Of these damn beach ball throws. Committed to the end, though. <laughs> the stream lasts another three hours of me doing this gets world record. <laughs> no, no. The fact that I'm this far is already insane. And the fact that I've done it twice, but more than double. Oh, wow. Uh, is even more insane. <laughs> Those almost will screw up. It's okay. What's everyone's high score in this game? <laughs> and if it's only like two or three, that's totally valid. I know some people uh, just saw the game, they're like, nope. <laughs> or they got to like 20 and they're like, eh. <laughs> but yeah, if you do actually want to at least try to get the moon for 100, try this method. Like it is definitely the best way. And the only time I've ever queued into uh, two player mode. Wow, that was almost, wow. I also did the soul too, at least on a stream I have two people to talk to, or at least my wards are, you know, yay, hi guys. Uh, <laughs> I did this like completely solo the time I did it, years back, and uh, I don't know, I was just kind of dying. Was I listening to music? I don't know. <laughs> I was listening to this song, so that counts. 250! So excellent, oh. 
think our high score is two? Yeah, that sounds that sounds fair. And two is okay. Two is a valid number for this. It's tricky. Not many people want to torture themselves. And I don't blame you. You're probably better off for it. <laughs> Jump rope, though, I can't do. Like, I, I, I've gotten past 100 once. Uh, on this file... What did we get that one stream, last stream? Uh, it was like 40 or 50 something in the jump rope. We need 100 for the, the star though, the second one. <laughs> Don't play the game, it's okay. Is in this or Mario Odyssey in general? Mario Odyssey is like the one Switch game I recommend to people who, well, especially just watch my stuff, who already have played all the Zelda games. I just love this game so much and you can't go wrong with it. There's just so much variety to do, and there's always something to kind of keep you entertained, and there's good variety and music and world design. It's so much fun. And a good difficulty curve, too. I think my favorite thing about this game, or one of my favorites, is just the fact that uh, it starts off simple. It's very accessible for everyone, but the more you get deeper into, like, the post-game and get, like, the side stuff, it really does become a challenge. Like, there's a lot of stuff that I really struggled with in the later game. Uh, so, <laughs> Nintendo's really the master of making games for everyone, which I, I appreciate. Same goes for, like, Breath of the Wild, too. Because, like, Breath of the Wild's like a game, uh, obviously there's a lot of tricky stuff and one-shots in the game, but, uh, ooh. <laughs> tricky shots and one-shots, uh, but as long as you prepare yourself well, you can pretty much overcome any situation. So, an unskilled player will just have to prepare more before bosses and divine beasts and such. But possible for most stages. I mean, hell, I played Ocarina of Time as, like, a, a two-year-old, so. Well, kind of. More so watched my brother play. Dad. Or my brother would do this thing where he would give me a controller that wasn't plugged in, and uh, he would think I was, or I would think I was playing because I was dumb and stupid and young. Uh, but it's okay. That's what all older brothers do. Let's be realistic. A two-year-old couldn't do Ocarina of Time. Or anyone below the age of eight. There's a lot of hard puzzles for someone that age. Stop at 420? No, can't stop there. It's not worth it for the funny. <laughs> That's fine. That's fine. You know what? I feel very satisfied. We, we had a good go. We had a very good go. We had a very good go. Am I mad? No. My hands are dying though. Um, I'm out of this nightmare that I created upon myself. So, yeah. I'll say we did good. What was that score again? I, I need to see the full. That's gonna be our new lucky number. Maybe unlucky. 332. One away from 333 though, okay. Um, only cause I was so close, it's like, man, we really could've. But also, I can't be mad because we did great. <laughs> We did really great. Oh, okay, after that, I'm gonna use the restroom. Uh, <laughs> sorry. We'll, we'll figure out what we're doing after this. Either it's a little more of this or it's the next kingdom. Um, I don't know. Because Boob Lane's a very calm vibe. And now there's music, so it could be fun. Let me know what you guys wanna see. Uh, we're gonna use the bathroom. We're gonna chill up here with, uh, you know, Sailor Mario. Okay. So, really quick, um, I will get the Guardian for the stream. Need a nice classic. I think uh, I think Piggy will do a good job watching the stream. So I'll be right back. Uh, have a birthday, Killer Master. Uh, <laughs> yeah, Mario. Wow, that fan himself off. Okay, be right back. Give me like a minute. I don't know. Two at most. All right.
All right. Well, I'm back. Piggy did a good job, right? Yeah, Piggy. Piggy always does excellent. Both and beyond. Also, my green screen fell over. Partially. One second. Uh, my green screen stand is breaking. What the hell? Jeez. Uh-oh. One moment. Okay, you have to stay. Come on! <laughs> I, I want this to work. The illusion's broken. I'm coming through the screen. <laughs> um, how does it break? That doesn't even make sense. What? What? Wait. It's either broken or just like. One second, guys. <laughs> oh my god. There's nothing to break, it's just a turn mechanism. Uh, might find some alternate way to prop it up in a moment. Uh, let's take my green screen off. First, first order of business. Ugh. This has never happened before. Something I've, I've had to stand for years and years and years. It's like, you can hear that. One moment, guys. Damn it. <laughs> It's like cracking or something. I'll have to buy a new one. And why then? It, was, it happened when I was in the bathroom? Okay, um, our plan B is to, uh, tape. Tape. Yeah, we're gonna tape it. Okay, wait. That's actually a funny screenshot. I won't stop them. Wait, no. Sorry, wait. Priorities, priorities, priorities. We need we need this zoomed in first. Yeah. It's funny. Yeah. Wait, move the, move the thingy. Okay, sorry. Um I'll show you the proper screenshot after this whole thing. But in the meantime, let's go get that tape and let's go tape this up so that my green screen works. Also, it's my JoJo poster in the background, so you can kind of see the back. Uh, see? We have, we have cool stuff. It is barely showing. Uh, <laughs> so let me get some tape and I'll be right back, guys. Uh, more piggy stream. We'll add in a... Uh, we'll add in a... Uh, 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 mud, too. No, I'm much replacing him. Sorry. Bye bye. So we, we got a, a solution potentially. Um, we got either masking tape or packaging tape. I don't know. I'm I'm really at my last straw here. So we take the masking tape. We can uh, open it up very nicely. 
Um, basically, we just need to stop the mechanism. So. I'm, I'm doing it carefully. I'm. If this all goes to plan, we should be good in like a minute here. Which would be awesome. Then we can play more Mario, and then have some fun. Carefree. Okay. Yeah, it's literally cracked, I see it. Okay, it probably won't be enough to hold it up, but we're trying anyways, because... Oh wait, actually it might! We're gonna put one piece on and it's already doing something. Which is a good sign. So the one piece tape kinda works. Add five more. Then we can fix it. Okay, good. Wait, it's working, guys. Okay. This is brilliant. I'm a genius. I'm now a repairman who can repair. Awesome. I just did a thing. I made that. I built it. Um... It's it's still a little low, so we're just gonna figure out it. Alright, one second. Oh wait, aha! I just raised the top part. And then we're so close. And I can just move it in a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So close. I am so happy that all of this is working beautifully. Ugh. Okay, stuff out of the way. And then just a corner. Yeah? This seems right. We're good, right? I'm just gonna move the, uh. Yeah, we'll fix that corner in a moment. I'm looking good. Okay, we're like pretty much there. Thank you, Tape, you're, you're working wonders. Wow, okay, um, now let's just fix the orientation of my, uh, Actually, I can probably raise it more. Okay. It's a little bit lower than normal, so that's why there's corners. Um, but. Okay, this is the best we're gonna get, which honestly is, this is fine, right? Yeah, look, it looks normal and uh, we look normal and uh, voila. <laughs> okay, tape over. We are good. Let's uh, let's chill by the seaside some more. Um, also that picture I took. It's pretty great. We're <laughs> pretty damn handsome here, so. Yeah, Mario. <laughs> okay. Well, what nice, calm objectives can we do now? Oh my god. But yeah, welcome, everyone. Sorry. <laughs> I see there's more people here now than before this all went down. <laughs> Funny. Oh, wow. Okay. I kind of want to go, uh, maybe through those pipes. Because those pipes look fun. Oh, Underwater themed version. Okay. Did the, did the piggy fall in the toilet or just muddy? Nah, mud just likes playing in the dirt. Let's go through here. Ah, <laughs> it's like a whole little maze. So cool. It's all segmented. This one seems to be a dead end now. Oh, wow. I was like, how are we going to get back? See, if Bowser was really clever, he would have just taken out those two blocks right there, and Mario would have never been able to get out. Nothing could kill him to send him back, he's just stuck. 
But Bowser's dummy. And oh wow, nice. <laughs> okay. You do that. I'll do that. I love the underwater theme of this. Oh. Oh come on. <laughs> I was really hoping to get that one. Oh! Ow! That's fine. Ah. Uh, nice. Well, that just takes you to that. Um, seems to be an exit of sorts. We need to get a Koopa shell there. Over 2,000 screenshots on your Switch. <laughs> That's a mood. I'm very picture photo happy. Or video happy too. <laughs> Zelda Odyssey? I mean, I love Mario Odyssey probably s second to most other games. But Breath of the Wild is always my favorite. Okay, let's kill the red Koopa. Oh, wait, maybe not. We have to position it so perfectly so we don't get stomped ourselves. Yeah, that was, that was inevitable. We didn't even need that one again. Okay, now we can, yeah. Do that. That worked out well. Now we're back up here. Oh, and then we got a crafty, nice, <laughs> zing around. Do we need the platform? I just guess it's gonna be there. Uh, no, doesn't look like it. Oh, ah, we could've just taken that pipe. So many different ways, crazy. Oh, nice, I was like, <laughs> like a 50-50 shot. Cool. Ocean bottom maze, hidden room. So the main room's somewhere then. Yeah, it was there. Oh, ah, ah, oh my god. It's not the top left, can it? Hmm. Because we made like a little bridge thing. Oh, we just gotta fall the same way we did. <laughs> it's so cool, it just pops in and out of you. Since I'm technically playing on my Switch OLED and not my normal Switch, uh, I don't have all of the past, uh, like, screenshots and videos from, like, those years back on this one right now, so I can't show them. Um, probably on my computer somewhere, I also just stole my old Switch. Um, that is at my parents' house. <laughs> this is the OLED, I got it back last year, though, because I, I wanted a nice handheld console. Because, I mean, well, Switch is nice, but, uh, I always thought the Switch screen was just a tad too small, honestly. Like, it's, like, it's nice for portable, but, like, it lacks just a little immersion factor, so, like, I'd rather just play on a TV or monitor. Um, with the OLED, it, it barely has any more, like, screen room, but it, it feels so significant in the grand scheme of things. Because it's just not, like, a huge be bezel, so games feel really nice to play handheld. So, off we go. Whoosh. Ah. What's that one taking us to? I don't know, I can't even tell. A lake, okay. Let's have a soda. Can you do a switch screenshot tour? Yes. There is one screenshot specifically I took in this kingdom in Mario Odyssey. It's like my favorite. It's so pretty. It is like kingdom. Hey. <laughs> Cool, that seaside connects the lake. You know, we can mess around here a bit. Because, I mean, the hat's consistent. <laughs> Why not? A sailor going to the lake now. It's a bit of a different vibe, I know. But you might like it. I like the zippers. Oh, yeah. And let's check all those purple coins. <laughs> Sailor in the lake. Wait, we actually never went up here. <gasps> Bright Goombas, yeah. <laughs> also, if all the Odyssey transported with us. Ow. Wait, maybe we should. Yeah. Bride. <laughs> Our wedding now. Oh, well, it's to get those coins, isn't it? Wait, oh, we need to get those Goombas somehow. Uh, crap. Wait, we can do that if we go up here, right? Lure him? 
Right? Hey, no, right here. Dummies. <laughs> and if we just high jump? Yeah, nice. Oh, it's also... Is that Sand Kingdom? Wow. So many little divergent paths. Yeah, this kingdom we barely spent any time on out of all of them. Take a lack of two there. Fish for a nice, nice little moon. Mm. Your friends bully at school because you're a Nintendo guy. They all think that PlayStation and Xboxes are better than Nintendo. Gonna be real with you. Those kids never make it far in life, so. Literally, they're just like the most generic people. And they suck now, but like, let them be stupid and have their stupid opinions. Because if you like something that's fun, then go for it. Nintendo's always just, you know, appeals to people just like having fun, chillaxed. You're not playing a game for a social status. It's like, you're playing to have fun. And that's why we're here. Being a nerd is a cool thing. Okay. Well, it's not a cool thing. This giant fish who doesn't want to bite. Come on! Oh, he's nipping at the line. With me there. <laughs> yeah, honestly, those kids were the worst. I dealt with them too. Uh, you know, back in like middle school, even a bit of high school too. I was just nerdy and awkward. Even more so than I am now. Oh! Uh. <laughs> it's always the sweaty dudes like obsess about Call of Duty and stuff like that. Still, you know, after all these years. Stuff like that's fun too, you know? It's one thing to like a game like that, another to make it your personality. That's when it's annoying. <laughs> to a baby Goomba. In terms of that though, I, I did have an Xbox. I uh, I got a 360 back when I was in 8th grade, and I, I had a lot of fun memories playing on Halo back in the day. Very fun. Uh, Halo 4 specifically. Tumble. PlayStation does have fun exclusives though. I did want to actually get a PS5, but literally those are never in store shelves. You can never get them easily. Uh, so I just eventually gave up. <laughs> Nerd Supreme. <laughs> there we go. Oh, just for a couple of basic points. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> nice. Restore some life. Group with the Wii and your family to always play Mario Party. That's fun. I, I love Mario Party. And it's really just like the perfect family game too, because uh, it's definitely the game with like the lowest amount of like skill requirement or ceiling. Uh, it's just fun. And just all the silly mini games and even just roaming the boards. Ow. Okay, we get it. You're late to your wedding. Woo. <laughs> More zippers. I like these. <laughs> Literally going around as a zipper and come out as a sailor. <laughs> it's two JoJo references in one. <laughs> Whoosh. Oh. Nice. Oh, we already got those, but <laughs> still nice to do it. Can we take a picture of that? I don't know. The hint art's like the one I never did all of them for. Because they're just tricky and involves going across two different kingdoms. Ooh, pumpkin head. Hello. Oh. Swimming one? Probably a fish is the best, but ground pounds also work. That was not bad. Okay. My parents always tell you to get after your Nintendo because you play too much of it. Honestly, that was mine too. Like, I grew up with Nintendo. Um, pretty much all my consoles were Nintendo. But... Yeah, I, I always wanted to play so much. So my parents <laughs> had to limit li me a lot. Which I, I understand. It's like parents don't want to see their kids get, like, addicted to a game. So. Because I could have very well easily have been. Because when I was younger, I had no restraint. Um, <laughs> Oop, ouch. I actually didn't need to go there. Yeah, Wii was so fun. I had a 64 growing up, a GameCube, a Wii, then a Wii U. That's a little puzzle. <laughs> We can do that. It's so heavy. Worked out for the best though, because like, the limited times I was allowed to play like growing up and stuff like that, like, as soon as I, you know, 
or graduated school and high school and everything. Uh, it gave me more time to kind of pursue my own uh, just hobbies and, you know, if you don't overplay something, you enjoy it more too. So definitely notice that. Come on. Because <laughs> I actually try to figure this out tactfully instead of just moving around. My favorite game, um, I always liked the 3D Zelda games growing up, so a Zelda game was always my favorite and still is true. <laughs> Except now it's Breath of the Wild, but growing up, it changed a lot as things were coming out. I want to see, I want to say Twilight Princess was like my most consistent, like, favorite experience, though. There we go. Nice. <laughs> that one you can fumble with the bet. You're disappointed when you realized Mario 3D World was on the Wii U and you had a Wii? Aww. Yeah, because that came out pretty early in the Wii U's life cycle. Also, is there a second one? <laughs> you know, tactful way of doing this? Oh, man. Uh, well, to be fair, we barely spent any time. Um, I want to say that there's always like a side moon, but maybe not. Hmm. Um. Oh, there's a flower. We gotta find the nuts for that. We are sailing the water. Such a peaceful kingdom. Also, if we capture something, it gets rid of the... Well, it drains stamina. <laughs> Rather, it gives us stamina. Air. Whatever. <laughs> I'm gonna call it stamina because it's the same color as the Breath of the Wild stamina wheel. <laughs> Oh, welcome. <laughs> Nintendo controller, joystick position. It's better than the PlayStations and Xbox. Uh, I like, well, in terms of joystick position, like Nintendo and uh, Xbox do it very similarly. So I like both the controllers a lot for that. PlayStations is weird. I don't like how they're together. Uh oh. Oh, just barely saved. Yeah, welcome to everyone tuning in though. We were just doing Seaside Kingdom. That's where we started today. And then, uh, well, moved on to this because we found a teleport. Never mind. I took something in my hand. Go, 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 go. Uh oh. It's not what I was expecting. I was expecting air right away. Air! Get it! Okay. <laughs> Never mind. That's something we did. That happens a bit. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I feel like this kingdom, there's so many like, little crevices I don't know. I keep going in the same spots, you know? I know there's a lot of stuff. Oh, purple coins up there. Yeah, this stuff, many things get on my grasp very easily. Nice. Sorry, fishy. If I see you, purple coins. Get them all in the line. Nice. We still didn't find that nut yet. What could that be? Okay, that's just coins. Talk to talk to. From the broken pillar? Okay. Maybe that's in the starter area or maybe it's here. There's a lot. Oh wait, broken pillar right there. Sometimes it's a matter of like stomping on something. It's like, oh that's a moon. Okay. <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh that's a moon. Uh <laughs> isn't the nut down in the big hole, is it? Because I, I don't know how you would be able to get it out, because you need a fish to go down. So I doubt you can swim all the way up before running out of air. Hmm. You know, it might be in that maze, though. Like the maze that you start in. That just feels likely. Some air. I do like the swing mechanics. Pretty simple, but you can do uh, little fast swims. Just little hat stuff. I just have a feeling it's here. Just feels likely. Oh, ow. Of course, more angry leaves. We're in all the water kingdoms. It's in the underwater maze? Okay, that's. Oh, yeah. well, look at that. We already got that one, didn't we? Yeah. But we're in the maze. It's probably at the beginning or something then. So you gotta, like, truck it all the way through. Oh. That wasn't there before, was it? <laughs> Yeah, I forgot. Yeah, every kingdom adds stuff, so. Uh oh. 
check it out. Two ways we can go about this, though. Oh, you can't take the nut up. Aha, so you have to swim through. That's okay, we should have known. <laughs> Stuck in a maze. This is fun. Thanks for being here, though, guys. It's it's been a fun day. Just playing more Mario. This is stream number three of this playthrough, too. So, we're doing good. Oh. I see what the problem is. Wait, we should be fine. We might take a hit or two of health, which is fine. Come on, where are the oxygen? It's okay. We'll only drain one? Oh, that was slow. It won't let me leave. There we go. We should be fine. And Mario's really good underwater, I guess. Checkpoint flag resets it. Okay. Throw it far, swim up. Throw it far. Oh, wait. <laughs> Never mind. Took the slow way. Come on. <laughs> I'm gonna stop messing around. I just want a faster way to do it. <laughs> I'm lazy. Got the moon down there. Uh oh. Don't get past four. I still want to keep my. Ow. That's okay. <laughs> Airy fell. Welcome to the water plaza. Thank you. Then chuck it. Ah. <laughs> yeah, the long throw was really long. Just in normal. Nice. Feels good to make things grow. Yeah. We're botanists. Have to get that. <laughs> Tempting. 3,000 coins. We're doing good. What's the secrets? Uh, on the lake shore. I knew there had to be more there. Yeah, we'll just get a couple more. How about that? Um, we to do a couple more here, then pursue the next kingdom, then? I think that could be fun. Can't go wrong with that. Uh... So if it's on the shore, oh, we can do all that stuff too. Maybe it's in the rock. I doubt it. It just feels a little too out of place. It's your secret. No, just a heart. Love money. Oh, is it literally just that? Lame. <laughs> Keep going. Breath of the Wall will be on Wednesday. On YouTube. In terms of this, yeah, I'm doing this today. Um, not too sure if I'm doing anything tomorrow or anything. Uh, but for sure, yeah, Wednesday on YouTube. We'll be live. <laughs> 39. Pretty good. Hmm. It's weird to think, yeah, like, uh, there's still so many spots we must not have checked, honestly. Yeah, we don't need that though. <laughs> that just directs you to the first area the first time you do it. Where can all the purple coins be? <laughs> um, that's what the Bowser amiibo is actually for for this game. They show you where all the purple coins are. Except I don't have any of the Odyssey amiibos. Those are like the amiibos that I most want that I never got. Wait, it's that one, right? <laughs> don't need that. Through the pipe. We didn't go through there, did we? Or the sides? You know what? Yeah, there's two little wings we can do. And that's probably where the purple coins are. They have to be there. <laughs> yeah, wait. Oh, music. That's the underwater version. <laughs> At least it's slow here. Oh. That's easy to mess. First go? Nice! <laughs> Don't miss that. Taking notes in the cliffside, and of course, I see a little crack in the wall. Nice. Oh, there's four of them there. Cool. Don't know the thing where you jump on the globe and the Odyssey's. Yeah, uh, it plays the song. There's like the globe you can keep jumping on at the on the Odyssey ship. I like that one a lot. Very nifty little Easter eggs. 
Plus, I like how you can enter from like different directions, like the chimney in the back. Or the top. <laughs> nice. Gotta go eat dinner, have fun with the rest of the stream. Thank you. Thanks for being here. When do I stream? Um, My only consistent schedule is I stream every Wednesday on YouTube. Wednesday night specifically. 6 Eastern. Um, Everything else beyond that, I announce a few days in advance on my Discord server. Usually it's weekends though. So, so weekends here. Uh, Wednesday nights on YouTube. <laughs> Nice. Well, that was a good one. Thank you, Cuddle Paws, for that. Oh, there is the door up there. And look at that. We're almost... Oh, wow. Just three more? You know, this sub area could have uh, the rest of the coins we need. Which is... That would be kind of nice. I like just these blocky ones with the ooh, reflective tiles. I feel like we have to go up there somewhere. Oh. I feel like that's our answer? No, but there's ghost coins. See, they always reward you, even if your thinking's out of the box. They know what to do. This game's too fun. <laughs> Oh wait, how about around back first? Hey, there they are! Yay! Coin jingle. Okay, well we got them all. <laughs> of course, there's just three condensed spots with a lot of coins. Four, four, and three. So we can buy out all the souvenirs. We've been getting most of the purple coins, not all, all the smaller ones. They only have 50 coins. Down right on it. Nice. Oh. <laughs> no. Sorry, coins. Oh. What? Wait, can we still do it? Yes, we can. Wow. <laughs> the recovery. Uh oh. I was really proud of myself there. <laughs> An amazing recovery followed by just a dolty fail. Got your first amiibos? Awesome. <laughs> what do I eat? I eat, uh, Croutons. So, salad only, but only croutons. <laughs> no. But I, I'm not a picky eater, though. Like, all in all. Oh! Bonk. <laughs> okay. Third go. Second one's always bad. Yeah. But it's fine. Like, it's the longest I've been in a single kingdom. Uh, which one? Because today, we just got to lake. I'm still wearing this from Seaside, though. It's kind of funny. The long as I've been in a kingdom, though, it's, it has to be a metro. Because we spent, like, oh, I think it was, like, over two hours in there last stream. Because, I mean, it's the biggest, so. <laughs> what do you expect? Like, the flower puzzles. Nice. We still gotta find that hidden moon somewhere. Oh, <laughs> yeah, we really messed up earlier. Brooklyn does eat croutons. Oh. Wait a second. We can go on top of that, can't we? Aha! <laughs> Whenever there's an elevator in games that goes up and down, as soon as you get to the top, make sure to wait for the elevator to go down, because more than likely the top can lift you somewhere. Ah, yes. A gaming platformer trope. Number 67. <laughs> Jump, grab, and climb some more. Yeah. Oh. Oh, nice. <laughs> I'll just do a gradual descent. How much does every coin ring give you? Is it three? 92. Yeah. Okay. Nice. Cling and climb. <laughs> just being very descriptive of the actions here. Maybe it's your time perception in the Metro Kingdom because it was so funny. Oh, uh, love that. <laughs> T-jokes. <laughs> yes. And the businessmen in the suits. 
Which is funny, because uh, since I went to Metro Kingdom last, um, well, I actually visited New York uh, over the weekend, last weekend, because uh, <laughs> it's based off New York, but I'd never been there. But yeah, last week I spent the weekend, uh, or spent the weekend in New York. It was a lot of fun. Went to like the Nintendo store there, um, one of the museums, the, uh, the MoMA, a few of the other shops, the islands. So I don't know, it was very cool. Had a lot of good food, like the pizza. <laughs> very fun. And actually, wait, really quick, uh, that reminds me of something. Because uh, when I was in New York last, I went to the Nintendo store. I got uh, this Mario Odyssey art book. I didn't open it yet because I haven't really had the time, but I never even knew they made it. It's literally a whole, like, huge, thick book of Mario Odyssey art. And, uh, yeah, well, it's going to be backwards, but I don't know. I just like ring up on all the different, like, art things, the settings, the characters, uh, alternate designs, stuff like that. So... It's it's gonna be very fun to read. I'm just gonna open it up really quick. <laughs> this is a Mario stream, so I might might as well at least open it and flip to a random page. Uh, take off the cover. Even like the back cover is like uh it's all like sketches and stuff. I kinda like that, you know? It's like a Pauline. <laughs> like like Lamode people. The lock ladies. Wally, yeah. <laughs> I like that, sorry. Um Let's just do one random page, and then and then we'll continue on our Odyssey. How about that? We'll we'll buy those souvenirs and then go to the next kingdom. But I have to do this. Sir. <laughs> oh wow, I thought the packaging was gonna be easy because it's a book, but no, it's like security sealed for a <laughs> New York store. Jeez. Um. Oh, there we go. Never mind. You just slip it off the side. <laughs> there we go. Can you tell it's the front? Just all art. Random page? Oh. Look at that. It's gonna be uh, blurry in some spots because the green screen filter, but there's like Mario. It's a nice like, just just painty aesthetic. <laughs> I don't know, just cool. I, I can't get too close though because I don't want to bend the spine or anything. Uh, so, and there's a lot of stuff to read. But maybe future endeavor. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to like ruin the bind on the book. <laughs> If you don't mind. Okay. Well, anyways, let's go buy some souvenirs and, uh, yeah, head on to the next kingdom. Oh, my book cover on my floor. <laughs> All right. <laughs> the Goomba's like, what? What? <laughs> so funny. Wait, can we zoom in? The Goomba Bros. Wait, even more. We need a, we need a close up on this. Like that. Rah. That's just silly. I like that. Which one? One and get confused, maybe. Oh, that one's still pursuing. Wait. <laughs> Yeah, Goomba Bros. Love that. Wait, can we do the different filters? Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Very funny filters. Oh, just plain. <laughs> the filters don't work very well in this one. Okay, this one just, yeah. <laughs> CRT Goombas. <laughs> it's like an album cover. <laughs> Yeah, it's got major album cover energy. <laughs> the Goom Bros. <laughs> That's what it's called. Okay, now just for the fun, I'm taking a picture of them all. We need the different types. Oh, wow, Coin Goomba. Sorry, I just dig that too much. Okay, one more. And then the coin. Just a baby Goomba coin. There we go. Three, two, one. Snap. <laughs> Goombros, yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's go get that uh, souvenir. The book looks straight up like the guide to the game. Yeah. No, it's cool. I'll have to read it and then uh, I might share some things about it in the server later. <laughs> when I do. 
Oh, I was like, where's the shop? Shop's up here. You'll have to wait on that, which is okay. Do that. There we go. Let's buy out all the things. We can maybe buy out the, uh, the stuff in the, the coin shop too. The yellow one. Oh, wait. Pirate? <laughs> That'll fit next time we go back to Seaside. You know, yeah, just buy them all down the line. It's fine, because we'll order the last one. Okay. We'll just buy a mechanic. Just so we have the options, of course. <laughs> we'll do random <laughs> spotting, recreate the image in game. I'll have to do that some time. Once we have all the kingdoms unlocked. Actually, no, screw it now. Pirate outfit. What's the description? Whether plundering cargo or burying treasure, you're gonna need an extremely fancy coat. <laughs> and yeah, <yarr! laughs> Yeah. There we go. Uh-oh. We are now Pirates of the Lake. Okay, for the time being, until we run back. I just stole everything from your shop. Oh wait, no, I didn't steal the souvenirs. <laughs> wait. We forgot to plunder, and we are pirates. Oh, it's just that, underwater dome. Yeah, that'll be a cute addition. Um, it's domes of the Caribbean. Cool. <laughs> Let's go, uh, warp back. 23 or 33, nice. We're doing good. You made it to the stream? Welcome, Sludgeon. We're just about to head up to the next kingdom. We, we did Seaside earlier, and then we found a painting to go back to this one. So that's why we're here. So, uh... Let's change into a neutral outfit. Going forward. Hmm... Maybe back to Sailor? I don't know. Just something fun for the time being that I'm thinking too hard about. Um, <laughs> yeah, Sailor for now. <laughs> Not so neutral, is it? But uh, that's fine. Thanks for entertaining content? No problem. <laughs> this is very fun. I like doing this today. But alas, it's time to head off. <laughs> Have all those moons to deposit. We still need to buy seaside uh, souvenirs, but we'll do it next time we visit. <laughs> or rather, we have to visit because we have to leave from here. So uh, let's deposit the moons from here. That skip. And cross Kingdom was pretty fast, honestly. Skip. Yay, Blue Blaine. <laughs> All right, <laughs> yeah, Sailor pulling up. Well, just quickly, uh, see that moon all the way up there, center right behind the lighthouse. <laughs> it's, it's like a pixel. Okay, so. We have 16 coins. That's enough for like two little souvenirs, maybe. So we can at least buy the sticker outside the Odyssey because I like doing that one. Then you can see it while it's flying around. My favorite boss in this game. Um, I won't say it if we haven't done it yet, but I, I don't think I could say. What is my favorite boss in this game? I like the Bowser battle we did earlier. Um, this one was pretty fun, where you just ride around. You know, I know what my favorite is. We haven't done it yet, so... We're the few no-spoiler people. Uh, we'll encounter it soon. Not next kingdom, but the kingdom after. That one's just cool. There we go. Hello. Oh. Get Seaside Kingdom sticker. And then we'll get a little uh, lamp, it looks like. 
Glass tower model? Yeah. I'm gonna really deck out this Odyssey going forward. Yeah, ruined boss. <laughs> okay. All right, but we are now sailing off to our next kingdom here. And <laughs> it's 10 more moons. We have plenty. Wow. Gonna pass 200 now. All the stuff in the back I didn't even get. <laughs> I really didn't go back there. 222. Two, two. Oh. That time we get... This time we get an alliterative number. Unlike the volleyball. Okay, seaside done. So, sorry to you, beach hat. <laughs> no water, because next it's the lunch on kingdom, <laughs> which I am so excited for. Lunchy on kingdom. Got a big soup. I'm I'm stoked. <laughs> oh, my hair's so flat. Cause <laughs> hats. Great combo, isn't it? Either want nice hair or you want nice hats. Pick one. All right, yeah, it's still all busted up. Yeah, Sailor. Blue sticker somewhere. <laughs> so it's, yeah, we know the moves. Stupendous stew is what we need, okay. Lunchion Kingdom. It's so pretty. Pretty tasty. Yeah. Well, this is literally food world now. After some cooking, so am I. And, well, with all this food, there's only one appropriate hat. Like, uh, can you really blame me for this one? You can't. So we're gonna be cooking up some perfection here. All right, <laughs> we're in our food world again. We're Chef Croton, back at it with uh, the spicy, spicy. Beans? Okay. Okay. No? Oh, you got a chef hat. See, we're matching. It was fit to be true. Here, I will take that hat. Whoop. Nice. <laughs> we got the chef. And we are back in our home. Oh, wow. Okay. Tomatoes. Oh. Tomatoes and beans. Nice and hot. Corn. We really got everything. Oh, wow. <laughs> the bean hit him from the back. Uh, don't chase me, tomato. <laughs> Literally, just food. Walking and sentient food. It's my favorite. Sentient food's like my dream. Like, I just want all food to just start walking and talking. Because it'll be funny. Whoosh! Nice. Yeah, now we gotta get Mario's hat soon. <laughs> right now, he's just Sailor. I like large corn. I like large corn. But not tomatoes. Oh. <laughs> ah! uh. Hop on out. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. Fire bubble? Come on. Not that. But it created the lava. Oh, that kills all the Goombas. Nice. Now all of a sudden we like the lava. Ooh. <laughs> Cruising, nice. <laughs> We're literally in lava. This stuff is lava. I love this. Swimming through the sea of uh, food land. Up there. <laughs> With this guy, we can jump and we can also. Uh... Oh, I don't actually like tomatoes. No, I like tomatoes. <laughs> Just in that context, when they're fiery and hot. Nah. Besides, warm tomatoes taste gross. Like a nice cold tomato on a good salad or sandwich. Yeah. You know? Different vibe for everything. Just gonna sprint, a jump, and then a dash. There's stuff everywhere. Okay. Um, we go around here. I, there's like a pit of lava I want to go to over there, but I'm not sure how we can get to it from here. Wait, no, not that. Never mind. <laughs> 
I think we're fine. What if these guys just burn up for me? Do they? They do, yeah! We are the lava after all. Really makes sense too. Oh! Ah! No, 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 no! Stay alive, Mario! No! <laughs> ah! I was trying to get over. Stupid lava bubble. Okay. I think the chef hat was like <laughs> among the more ones I was excited for. I love being chef. Whoa. There we go. Now we just go across. Yeah. Up here. What do we got? The Brutals are back. Yeah, there's a second rematch. So we got one of them before. Stupendous Stew? No. My Stew has a birdie on it. Who is it, Matt? Oh, it's Pukey Puke. Come on. There's already enough puke. Just all alongside the sea. Ah! Gross. There's a place where we keep food. Bonking. <laughs> Clear the poison. Spewart? <laughs> Is that actually his name? I don't pay attention. <laughs> what are their names? There's another Brutals. I know the big one's Mad and Brutal. Oh, I guess we can stop him, right? By stopping at him? That's what I tried. More hearts. Oh, it's all the jelly beans he's knocking around. Oh, wow, we just dodged that. Ah, wow. Damn it. <laughs> okay, we're good. Here, if he charges towards me, we're gonna... Nice, okay. That stops it. Speed on a strat. Nice, okay. No puking in the kitchen. Come on. <laughs> Clean hands only. Okay. Yeah. Bean jam. <laughs> Spoo it. <laughs> so who are the other names then? That is funny. I dig it. I haven't worn this hat since the cooking run though, so it feels pretty great. I don't know if we use music from. I think we use music from this kingdom in the video. Pretty sure near the end. Okay. Um. What's that smell? What is that? Wait, those birds are kind of cute. Like little snowballs. <laughs> yeah. Go birdies. I like how the forks move to the prongs to be like hands. Home to the hugest flavors anywhere. These are kind of on fire right now. Oh man. Love the town. Green bean. Wait, <laughs> green pepper. Steak. Oh no. He wants the meat. Nice. <laughs> oh, I got the shrimpies. Uh. <laughs> Oyster shells, eggplants, and a giant green pepper. All the polygonal food. So great. Whoever decided to add a food kingdom in this game was genius. <laughs> and hey, uh, man, Junalt, uh, thank you for the raid. Uh, trying to get friends to do that with me because you're sick with the flu, but wanted to show, wanted to support me and the ghost to do. I'm sorry. Love the content. Thank you, though. I'm, I'm glad you're here. And, uh, yeah. Well, you can have a good time then. I I appreciate any support or any effort too. This really means a lot. Hands. <laughs> wow, like can shotgun spread and <laughs> second volley. Yeah, we're in food paradise now, so everything happy. Ow, <laughs> that wasn't happy. Also, sorry for getting your name wrong. I I had to read it slow at first. Pillars? I, I I see. I see what we're doing. Yeah. 
There we go. <laughs> I see a lot of purple coins on, so top of column. With purple coins means we can get our chef hat. <laughs> purple tomatoes, rather. Wait, let's get those more tomatoes. Wait, we have 15. That should be enough, right? There we go. 15 out of 100. Yeah, we can do that. Nice. What do these guys have to say? No. Okay, let's get our hat. Let's call you June? Alright. Yeah, <laughs> hit one the fork heads, yeah. <laughs> also, just funny in general. Okay, chef hat? Well, of course. Oh, wait. <laughs> uh, I mean, I mean, bye. There's also a painter one, which I think is uh, very fitting for just the vibrancy of this region. It'll probably be the last thing we get, though. There's a, oh, fancy forks? Food pile? Oh, yeah. Okay, when I was younger, I used to have so many uh, food toys. Like, you know, like the plastic ones? It's like, you know, it'd be like fruits, like apples or grapes, or just like a can of beans or something. Uh, chicken. Like, I used to have that. I used to have like those, uh, those kitchens or whatever. Like, <laughs> the McDonald's stovetop or just like the normal one. Uh, I used to love food toys when I was younger. So this kingdom just reminds me of that, and it's like the funniest thing. Crystal, I'm glad you can catch another stream. What do you miss? Uh, we just did Lakeside Kingdom, or Seaside Kingdom, and a little bit more of Lake. Uh, so we just got here. Cans everywhere and food, and <laughs> it's so fun. They're just getting hit. The meat! The meat! The bird's gonna take it! The bird will see the meat! <laughs> the meat's on the plateau! <laughs> a great plateau. Well, it's got a pretty great piece of meat on it, I'm sure. Oh, these things. Monkey. Gold turn up. Boom. Nice. Ah. Out comes the moon. We finished the recipe. Ooh, just missing turnips. Oh, normal turnips. Ah. What the? What did we do wrong? Points. Just a couple, but it's worth it. There we go. Make it extra seasoned. Two more coins. <laughs> I'm gonna bake for you. Oh, we just made turnip soup. What if we made bean soup too? Oh, we have to kick it in. I, I don't. We're gonna be that accurate here. We just kind of flail around. Hello. Hi, Mr. Fork. <laughs> I love these guys. They just they have their arm hands, <laughs> fork hands, whatever. Arm hands, whatever. Chef's come. Yeah, we are chef. Thank you. Isn't bean soup just chili? Yeah, that makes sense. This it threw me off with the colored beans. I love chili, oh my god. That's another story though. Food ball. Got this pot in a good simmer. Brings out the flavor. A little hotter? Hmm. You know, I can help out with that. No, just that. It's like a sub area, but easy. Oh! Uh, <laughs> right on the rim. Let's not mess up this time. Oh, wait. <laughs> Jeez. What am I doing? Got a moon. A strong simmer. When you're in primary school, part of you spent multiple lunch times imagining a world with everything made from food. Like wheels for cars made from donuts, lampposts made from pretzels. It's kind of throw you back to that time. That's amazing. I love that. Just everything has food. Food art. <laughs> food life. I don't know. Food's just funny, so <laughs> I totally dig that. That's awesome. Ow! We can go back, right? Ah, just barely. There we go. It's like this little platform where we now created. Nice. Oh, we'll pull two off. 
Okay. Yeah. Cooked up that pot. I wonder if we can get a fire guy into that one uh, pot in the town itself. I doubt we can. I'm not sure if that's a special moon either. Extreme simmer. Yes. Spicy. I don't think we can climb the food wall. Yeah, it just, <laughs> it's just a blockade. Very funny one at best. <laughs> Yeah, I know I messed up the sub area. <laughs> Did we just cook something in that thing? Yeah, we did. We hit the bean in the in the bean chili, <laughs> or whatever. It's that now, I guess. Totally unintentional kick. I just heard the sound effect. Oh, again. Was that a can? Jeez, this is everything ending up in the soup. Yeah, another. We actually saw that one, though. Three coin for bean soup. Wait, one more. Trick shot. Aw. <laughs> That'll take a star off our five-star restaurant now. How sad. Okay. Onwards. Can we get up here? No, but I feel like it's alluding to something. Aha! We have to go around. There's a lot to do. Oh, okay. Salt pile aisle. <laughs> Aha, rhyme. There's a thingy there, isn't there? Oh, <laughs> of course. Hat door. Yeah, that soup's gonna be totally normal. We're not just messing up the recipe. <laughs> Threw turnips, beans, and cans into it. Oh, there was two paths. That one has thingies on it. <laughs> oh, we almost got them all too. Why'd I do that? Nice. He's just like grapple around, which I dig. Oh, and it goes back. Nice. Ah. <laughs> Close. Okay. Nice. Got the first one. There's one right there, too. We got a side flick to it. I guess we could take either way, but I'm a fan of that way. <laughs> nice. What if there wasn't a platform to catch you, too? Like the hard version of the sub area. <laughs> Messing up the soup just like in Ratatouille, yeah, but it, it turns out good eventually. Cans, beans. A can bean tur turnip. Nice. Mm -hmm. 24. Can't wait to buy some souvenirs. Let's also go around too to see the specials. What's on the menu here? Kind of an underground uh, street food. Um, <laughs> this area, okay. Pretty sure it's dead end. I mean, that's five tomatoes. I love that. What am I drinking? I'm drinking uh, one of these. It's really good, actually. Uh, it's a, tamar a tamarind flavor. Uh, it's a, like a Mexican soda, so <laughs> Jaritos. They're very good. Um, I had them for the first time like last year, I, I want to say. What, a year ago? Tasty. I can't describe the flavor. I just had it once and I like it. Um, it's a brown soda, which doesn't say anything. Um, I guess it's kind of like a... Hmm. It's like an earthier tasting, like cola, Dr. Pepper fusion, like earthier tasting. I don't know. It's good. There's also like fruitier ones, but I like that one a lot. So. Hmm. 
I literally had it on my counter uh, from earlier when I went upstairs to get the tape. <laughs> so I just took it down with me. Oh. Ah. Alright, get the Goomba. <laughs> we didn't mess it up. Okay, got it. Wait. Goomba trick shot? Yeah. Oh, wait. <laughs> wow, that would have been awful. Wait, yeah. I'm getting scared. Getting cold feet here. Oh, yeah. For every right reason. <laughs> why, why didn't I just get off the Goomba? That's what a smart person would have done. Okay, back up the waterfall. I can only go up that way. Wait, no, I can't. <laughs> Never mind. I just have to jump. Whoa. There's not a high jump, it's more of a sprint. I should be. Okay, I'm gonna stop. <laughs> that. That. Nah. Damn it. Why am I not patient? That way, yeah. <laughs> He's stuck. Okay. Now we'll get the thingy very safely. Oh, maybe not. Okay. <laughs> it's closer than it needed to be. That I own. I own a zing around first. What are the Goombas for? Are they just chilling here? I think they're quite literally just chilling here. Okay. <laughs> just, just to be Chef Goomba, you know? You gotta culturize the land. Everyone's Chef. And Hammer Bros. Yeah. First time seeing these now. To throw an attack, shake, shake, shake. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> throw both. Yeah. Oh wait, look at me. Yeah, you got a mega fast one. Also, it determines the range too, right? That's, that's a shorter one. Yeah, I think it goes longer range too and faster. Actually. It's always a funny shake control, which I, I like the motion in this game, so doesn't bother me. Like cheese blocks, crispy cheese. <laughs> First playthrough Odyssey, this will be my third actually. Um oh ow. Wait, no, I need my I need my guy back. We played it twice like within like the year and a half span that it came out. Uh we haven't really touched it in years, so. Oh, oh. <laughs> good save, I guess. Uh When the audio quality sets to 144p, is the audio bad? Is that way for everyone, or <laughs> should it be? Or is this like a like an internet thing? Okay. Um, this is a bit special now. I feel like we can do this, but it's not intended. I feel like there's an easier way. If we go around. Yeah, there was the cheese blocks. I feel like maybe unlocks a flower. Put the door. It's fine. Okay, good. Sorry. <laughs> uh. <laughs> oh, you can, oh, you can wait for our bounces. So he bounces consistently, but a high one, we can go like that. Jump out. Boop, boop. And yes, we did it. So, crafty. Oh, more onions. And you're trash, that's okay. <laughs> Is that the one? Yeah! These are like free moons. Just gotta go past the hammer bro blockade. Beat him up. Nice. Kill him. <laughs> Let's protect the turnip. Nice. <laughs> Just cutting him through. Yeah! Ow! Of course a spiny would get me of all things. Is there a thing? Ah! <laughs> Tear down the cheese! Bad lying cheese. What's that? Oh, we need to do that. That's for the story. Where's the turnip? The turnip went away! I guess we did kind of stray far from it. That's probably our bad. We can't go too far from. Bum, bum, bum. <laughs> That's okay. We'll just wait for the bounce. 
Not that bad. <laughs> oh, went right to the right one. Yes. There we go. Uh, oh no! You did that again. I messed up so bad. Uh, I thought I had that, and then I, I didn't. Clearly, so. See, it's hard when it's all lava. <laughs> okay. Speed run. We'll do this again. Ah, <laughs> uh, make it. Okay, good. And then we go quickly. Fast as him. And then take one. He's not gonna hit me with the frying pan. He thought. There we go. See? Gotta be fast as, uh, uh, steaming hot dishes stew. <laughs> that was a good one. I can't. I can't change the camera angle. Oh, interesting. I was gonna try to get a picture. There we go. <laughs> so funny. Just for you, the stew. <laughs> yes. Just making an offering. I like that actually. Wait, wait. Oh yeah, I went away. <laughs> there we go. Sorry, we have to keep the silly ones. What version? I, I don't know if there's like version differences, is there? Oh, okay. We got a cut in the wedge of the cheese, so we're good. I think it's probably up to date. Oh, wow. Okay, good. Ow! Oh, the turnip got him! Yeah! Crushes spiny little head. Nice. Okay. Boom. No. Okay. Safe stop. Professional screenshotter. Thank you. <laughs> I just said I was silly. How to capitalize on the moment. Golden turnip recipe number two. <laughs> Silly cans. Can do. Yeah. I really like this kingdom. I'm exploring it. Thank you again, guys, for being here. Cause uh, it's been fun to do this again. Cause yeah, we did the first two streams uh not last weekend but the weekend before. So we'll definitely do more and more. Cause there's just so much to do. Between the main game, post stuff. Probably eventually turn to 100%. I think I think it'll be fun. Nothing too consistent, but I like playing it. It's one of my happy games. <laughs> yeah, under the cheese rocks. Speaking of which, we didn't read the uh, um, the brochure to this kingdom yet. Better. Big pots on the volcano. Dive in. We sure can. Okay. <laughs> Little food maze in the pot. Path in the meat plateau. Okay. Well, Luncheon Kingdom. Popular destination for the hungry. <laughs> Me always. Mont Valbono. Population plentiful. Size buffet. Ooh. <laughs> Locals. Volban. Volbanans. Volbanans. Sure. Fulbanans. Currency, tomato shaped. Industry, food, and minerals. Temperature, average 93. Yeah, it's pretty spicy. Gates of a gourmet paradise. The historic old town. On your way to Mount Fulbono, you'll pass through the old town. Ringed by the ruined walls that once enclosed the town. These sturdy, cut stone walls even now suggest the prosperity of those times. Atop the walls are little mounds of salt, carried by the wind and piled up naturally. Visitors can walk Along the tops of the walls, do so if you get a chance. The sights here are very different from the colorful scenery of Peronza Plaza, 
but equally breathtaking. <laughs> it's cool. It's like the, the walls to an ancient food kingdom where food ruled the world and was sentient. Fun. <laughs> My kind of kingdom. A pot cooking on a volcano? Only here. Yeah. Cooking with a volcano. Surrounded by strange pink lava, Multiple Bono is colorful and vibrant, a vision straight from a picture book. It's famous for its cuisine, with dishes simmered over the volcano. <laughs> Gotta use your natural resources somehow. Uh, <laughs> and chock full of the local produce that grows to normal size thanks to the volcanic climate. Cool. <laughs> cheese hard as rock, yeah. Crispy. The cheese in Mount, Mount Volcano is quite, quite hard, likely because it's left near lava and dries out completely. The local chisel it with hammers, you're welcome to join. We have, okay, let's see, Cooking Carnival. The highlights of Malt Volblano's year is the Cooking Carnival, where visitors from all over the world come to sample the famous stupendous stew. While cooking on a volcano is of course a grand spectacle, the dish itself has a surprisingly delicate flavor, described most frequently in reviews as melty deliciously. <laughs> nice. An interesting place for meat, the meat plateau. The giant slab of meat used in the stupendous stew is crusted generously in salt and left to rest on a high perch near the volcano. Aging the meat, yeah, aging the meat high above lava, cooled by the wind, is essential to create the core flavor. If you arrive before the cooking carnival, be sure to take the opportunity to visit the platform and see the meat resting soundly before its long journey. Wow, just perfectly aged meat, you know? It's, it's marinating in salt. Best seasoning, yes, of course. <laughs> it, that's where all the salt mounds are coming from, sure. Peronza Plaza. Be sure to visit the centrally located Peronza Plaza for a friendly welcome. Once among the colorful heaps of giant ingredients and succulent smells, you may find it hard to leave. Okay. <laughs> well, yeah, already too hungry after all the food talk, but we just have to deal with it. <laughs> Very astute. We gotta light the fire, don't we? Yeah. Oh wow, we're almost in the fire ourselves. <laughs> Flame Mario. Cooking up a storm. What's one that captures it well? I mean the base does. <laughs> Also, just funny pose. I don't know. Um, wait, we need a good one. Uh, the base one's pretty good, too. So, might just stick with that. <laughs> You're just funny. That for the sake of it, but the best one being... Yeah. And base screenshot. Sorry, I have to take options and I'll delete the worst ones later. <laughs> It's not like I can add a filter later, but I can always delete stuff later. <laughs> Just standing there. Hot Mario. <laughs> okay. How are we doing? Came from YouTube? Welcome! Uh, doing very fun, uh, because I'm having fun. Just going about this kingdom. We did see that earlier. So yeah, it is great. Hot Mario. Currency is croutons? Yeah, of course. <laughs> Croton, crouton, it's the best way. Oh wait, don't hit him yet. Okay, we need one tomato there. Like that. And we need another one here. Perfect. They're like a little lava pool, so I can't touch them. Good. Over here. Like creating our own little platforms. Also, the tomatoes are neat. Even these little cool enemies that you can't capture, but are good for like utility. We use our enemies for our own gain. Oh, thank you. We capture you. What else is there? Um, good for here. So many branching paths, though. Really quick. Oh wait, no. Damn. I feel like we needed that. Yeah, I see some cheese behind. It's okay. We'll get him again. It was the breath of the wall to Mario's. Very true different. I feel like they just went nuts with like the base formula of like Mario 64. I mean it's the most similar Mario game to this because they both have like the miniature open worlds so. 
Other Mario games didn't do that to the same extent. Sunshine a bet. Oh, of course. From their own blockade here. Woo! Flippy over the tomato. Oh yeah, that's the uh that secret. A little tunnel. <laughs> More turnips to the Yep, of course. Whoop. Uh, this isn't the easy one. I can't mess this one up, though, because uh, it'll take a lot longer to reset. I think we've done that. Let's take him. Build a little staircase for ourselves, but don't go too far from the turn up here. There we go. That should be good. We just needed a little bit to make a little staircase. Nice. The triple jump saved. Like that? Nice. Ooh. Oh, not, not the crash, but the win. Whoop. Soup time. Oh, wow. <laughs> Perfect. Wish. Ah, uh, sometimes the camera can't move. Ah, uh, it's in our memory. <laughs> Wait, can we do a soup trick shot really quick? Boom. No, okay. <laughs> Not worth it. Anyways. Okay, warp there. And then, yeah, we'll take that uh, lava bubble. <laughs> That's what they're called, right? There's so many. They're just always in unison. Kind of funny. Yeah. Here we go. 41 already. Cool. Getting them at a brisk speed. Also, we should go to that side thing because it's cool. Ah, wait, we have to really get out. <laughs> The best way to do this. Ooh, nice. Normal sprint over. Look at that. Full C. Nice, nice, nice. Ooh. Nice and plump. I love all our tomatoes. Oh! Love a bowl maze. There we go. I'm gonna do that one as a straightaway. Uh, we only need to do it once. Nice! Went right to a, a flag. Pop right into it. Ah! <laughs> Play all different in my head. <laughs> yes. Hi! <laughs> Forks with arms. Here to fix all the spots that crack open, but just your luck. Ah! <laughs> Knocked on his melon. <laughs> uh, using food into your vocabulary is pretty based. Nice. I just love flipping around. It's so, it's so fun. Oh, okay. <laughs> I figured that was for a moon. I don't know if it affected, like, the other area. Ooh. I mean, I guess it makes the most sense. <laughs> what else would it be? A purple coin? That ain't how that works. Ow. Stupid green. I like green peppers, though. They're probably the best one because they're just so versatile. They're good on pizza. Okay. How does everyone feel about different pizzas? Uh, ooh. More like a pepperoni pizza, like plain, or like everything pizza? Because like I, I love pineapple pizza. I'm one of those guys. Uh, but I love the everything pizzas too. Um, there's not really pizzas I hate. It's usually the stuff that involves like, like replacing the normal sauce with like barbecue sauce. I don't like that. Or like ranch. Uh, I never had like anchovies before either. So it's like really weird things I don't like. Like sauce other than just a good tomato. Ah. Sausage and mushrooms is very good. Whoosh. Like mushrooms is kind of a must for me. <laughs> oh. All the peppers are screwing me up. Like who's the real enemy here? No. No, I have to get the coins. Damn, it was only one. I really made a mistake. Okay. We'll be okay if we do that. No, we won't. <laughs> Actually dying in the 8-bit worlds. Hey, at least we have a uh, thingy. 
most hyped thing about Tears of the Kingdom. Um, honestly, I just can't wait to see how it's going to surprise me. I'm not a person that likes speculating too much. Uh, although I do like some of the replacements for like some of the, the runes, like the time reversal ability and whatnot look cool. So I'm just going to see how it's going to play out. New mechanics with uh, just all the Sky Islands, honestly. Oh. Yeah, my bad. We're not going to fool around in the stupid ways now. Come on, get it, get it, get it. It's like you can't get it all the first time anyways. I just really wish it was possible. It's like, they're just question blocks. Nothing cool ever happens in them. Me almost screwing up. But that was a neat one. We could, like spiral around. The other person likes mushrooms. I, yeah, mushrooms are awesome. I feel like there would have been a secret. this <laughs> bit of a tease mushroom peach's castle <laughs> this is pretty beautiful this might be a place we have to check out at some point yoshi's house hmm <laughs> Very classic. I can't wait to go here. So cool. 64 vibes. Oh, I love that. Whoop. Up, 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 up. You know, climbing these trees has got to be important. Oh! What's that? This tree, more so. That's no moon. <laughs> I love that. Mario 64 type beat. I've gone to Peach's castle. No, Yoshi. Well, I can't wait to visit at some point in the adventure. But not now. For now, we wait. <laughs> Super Mario 128 won. Yeah, come on. We could easily double that. Double the amount of content. What? <laughs> <laughs> nice. Can we seal the pepper hole? No. <laughs> it's gonna seal our fate though. Of, oh, it just pops out randomly. Oh, what? <laughs> yeah, totally randomly. No, I'm sorry. I feel it's targeted, honestly. Skyward Sword is very fun. <laughs> oh, we already did that. Let us go this way. That's back where we found the turnip, but let's see what else is here. Oh yeah, there's a door. Oh, let's pursue the main story first. What's that? Yeah, I'm excited for that. Nice. I love this flipping around as Mario. It's just fun, very fun. Knock him off. Sorry, Spiny. I thought you were lava proof. <laughs> Not my problem. This feels like a moon. Nah, there's some really obscure ones though. <laughs> meat plateau. <gasps> we gonna be meat. A lot of salt. Break off the salt. Yeah. Boink. <laughs> jump, jump. Of course, now the bird sees it, because we we did all the hard work. <laughs> Mario meat. Yeah. We're wanted. Yay. We get a bee and a feast. And we are a big piece of meat. No way. Cool. Thank you, bird. Birds make great cooks, apparently. <laughs> Your own little maze of food. Squash and... Peppers, I guess? I don't even know. 
Uh, oh, wait, you can do that. Nope, Ford, you're good. <laughs> Mario meets him. <laughs> There we go. First multi-moon here. <laughs> Just three. But we got a cool cutscene to go with it. Uh-oh. <laughs> no. She's cooling it off. How could you? I spoke too soon. Now it's extra spiced. <laughs> So funny. Okay. Climb up the cascading magma. I'm excited. We're like so far in the kingdoms already. Like there's only a few left after this one actually. But I mean, this game is short on the shorter end. It's just so much you can do with it. And re revisit and uh <laughs> yeah, the world's keep getting at it too. There's a fire bros. Wait, what sort of stickers do we have around? Okay, Forgotten Isle and Bonitian, Lake Lamode, Shaveria, Steam Gardens, Bublain, Tostarina. We'll get this one soon too. Maybe go up the wall. Fork people. Oh. The Hatless Challenges. I think it's cool in games like this. They give you so many things to mess around with. Uh, then for occasional challenges, you just take those important things away. At first, sometimes you're just bumbling around. You're like, wait, it's hard without that crutch. I feel like there's like a thingy. No, just salt. But that's a thingy. A cannon? Yeah. Yeah, there's like shortcuts around. Blast off. Oh, I saw purple stars. <laughs> oh, we can cut out. Nice. Convenient for me. <laughs> There's just so much. This food paradise. We gotta go have a good stream. Thank you. Ah, uh, I messed up. Oh, wait, no. They disappear. Ah, uh, <gasps> I thought we were safe. Odyssey was the second video game you ever played after Breath of the Wild. Main story of Odyssey was so short compared to Breath of the Wild at first. You thought you've been cheated. Oh, yeah. This is totally different. Like, I was saying earlier, it's meant to be, like, approachable in that sense, where you make it short and easy in that extent, so uh, anyone can just have that full experience sort of thing. But there's so many side things that, whether you just want to play it for a little bit or just milk it for every possible drop of fun, uh, you know, you can. Or cheese. Okay, um... You know, I might as well take the cannon again. I wonder if we can just cut around. Think we can? Yeah, we can. Who's stopping us? <laughs> no one. Okay, now let's get out. We'll just we'll hold off me. <laughs> Salt sea. There we go. Had, had to get them. Of course, yeah, just brittle pieces of uh, old food. Comes. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I love the little secrets. Is there anything else? Probably not now. It was pretty open, just the fun sea to traverse. I just know things are different the second time around. Which is cool too, like a lot of these uh, bigger areas, it's like, there's like a main story objective, then a bunch of things change, and uh, for that second half. We're in that second half now. Oh. Yes, made it. I believe we should go back to the town. We can, we can hit it up. Yeah, beans. <laughs> Cans. <laughs> Is that a seed? Oh, I thought it was a seed. It's just a bean. 
I don't think there's seeds in this kingdom. Uh, heart. Yay. Oh, wait, there's Slot's house. How did I miss that? I was so distracted earlier. Time to do a bit of gambling. But skillful gambling. Love how they kind of franchised out here. Oh, I got this. Ooh, okay. About the best we could have done. Nice. Ooh. <laughs> Go. We have a lot of moons. It's weird how you can just like skip the main story objectives to like just go to the Odyssey. I forgot if I mentioned, but I'm not sure if that changes the ending at all. If you don't like do the main story things and then you beat the game. I only know the one ending. Uh, who knows? You need that moon requirement. So again, yeah, you can really beat it fast. People will literally just play the game for five hours to beat it. Like, what? <laughs> it's like, we could technically leave right now. What's the fun in that? <laughs> we made the requirements so low. <laughs> oh, okay. A uh, uh, pipe? Cool. Pipe down. Completely overshot it, too. Okay. Hammer, bros. What? Oh, I thought we got him down. I was, I was so confused. There we go. Hammer Bros are awful in like the 2D Mario games, especially the old ones. It's like they're so unpredictable. And uh, yeah, one of the reasons why I couldn't play those games. I need to actually like legitimately, legitimately play that game. Cause I don't think I ever beat it. And those even with warp zones. I'm actually just trying to play it without warp zones. Funny thing about that though, there's probably an alternate universe somewhere where uh, the people who played Mar or like when the original Mario Bros came came out, nobody knew about warp zones, which is kind of funny. It's basically the game's way of adding like save points. <laughs> pluck, pluck and peel. Oh, wow. <laughs> All the ruins are crumbling. Uh. And then we go there. Wait. I always check my sex. A lot of time it's just like a... <laughs> it's a pedestal for the moon. How fancy. I'll go find the flowers of magma. Magma? Why aren't I saying magma? Love just randomly changing my vowel sounds. <laughs> okay. Oh, one more fire. We can do that. Yeah. Those like back pass. Mm. So on a side note, I'm trying to think of uh more emotes we can add to the Twitch, because I'm pretty sure I can add more now, I just don't know what. <laughs> we have a good little variety now, so I'm pretty happy about that. And we have the bread, and the drill shaft, and the chef, and, uh, piggy. Probably, like, another one or two more spots, I think. But I like using them. And we added those to the Discord server, finally, too, because I've been kind of revamping the server for the sake of, like, you know, Making it more synchronized, so we have all the Twitch emotes on Discord now. That's been fun. Chomp. Okay. I don't want to poison everything. Oh. Oh, they're fire ones. Right. Okay, can you get out, Cappy? Ah. Ah, oh, wait, <laughs> come on. Wait, what if we just oof ourselves? Because I kind of want that piranha plant back. Boink, and into wherever. Piggy's cute. Yeah, thank you. Piggy, appreciated that compliment. Piggy's right here, so. <laughs> Piggy says thank you. That reminds you of uh, all the meals Breath of the Wild Challenge run. Thank you, yeah. 
That's the last time I wore it, and that was a blast, honestly. Oh, no, what? You're, you're joking. <gasps> what are the odds of the two stones hitting each other and then I lose my hat? Okay, you have to free yourself, Cappy. Okay. Because what I'm trying to do, <laughs> trying being the keyword here, you have to eat this, right? And then we can capture you. You have to turn very slowly. Spit. Very slowly as well. <laughs> oh, wait. Good. And farther and faster? Okay, we need the fire wall, though. We can create so much. Well, that's nice. You have an Enderman that size? He has very long legs. Oh, that's cool. In terms of Minecraft plushies, it's all uh, a lot of piggies. So, yeah, I have three of them. My girlfriend has three of them. Uh, they're all matching. We have Oink and Piggy as the normal ones. Uh, the Mud ones are Mud and Biggie, and the Saddle ones are Penny and Zoid. Zoid because its face is quirky and looks like a trapezoid. Uh, <laughs> they're all they're all similar, but we showed Mud earlier. Otherwise, they're mostly identical. <laughs> He's a Mud Piggy. Another one just a normal with the saddle. Yeah, so literally just all Minecraft pigs because they're just silly. Troll Chef, what's on the menu today? Hmm. Some nice uh, crystal quartz tomatoes. Very delicious. If you have the teeth to eat them, they will bust your jaw. Uh, <laughs> there we go. Great pig names. Thank you. Thank you. Ooh. Can we get up here? I think we can. Yeah, nice. A little bit of a shortcut. <laughs> Gorons enjoy that? Yeah, if you're a Goron. It's for the Goron run, don't worry. Tomato. Oh, lava to normal. Um, we definitely skipped like a little bit. Oh, more peppers. <laughs> uh oh, we died too much to peppers. <laughs> Ow. Good thing I didn't get green pepper bonked. Happens too much. <laughs> Such a weird thing to say. Only things that can be said in Mario Odyssey Luncheon Kingdom. Got bonked by a green pepper. Fell into lava. I guess just for the coin, you know? Nice. Oh, come on. <laughs> Wait for it to twist. We can get all the purples. Literally, this whole thing just like just one wall of platforming jungle gym. <laughs> That's why I love the game. You know, some parts are designed to be like more linear like that. There's still many different approaches you can take. I mean, when you revisit, there's uh, well, they make interesting use out of past areas too. <laughs> Zal world though. <laughs> oh wait, I, I did the wrong button, didn't I? Okay, now time to get up. This time as a lava. The soup, it's almost complete. It has the dried crud pieces from earlier. <laughs> okay. Now we gotta fight Chef Bird? What? I don't make the soup. Don't throw your durians at me. Okay, these are free coins. You know, let's clear the whole soup. <laughs> Yeah. Banana pieces. I don't know what that is. Oh, trying to spit at me, but I'm lava. Ah, no, not peppers. <gasps> I don't need more of that. Durings are fine. We don't get hit by them ever. Ah. Nice. <laughs> Tremendous. Much appreciated. Well, if we beat out another chef, it's like a cooking competition. Then we'll become the top chef. Come on, we need Master Chef time. We are the ruler of these culinary lands. Yeah, it's puking. Okay. This time zigzag puke. Oh, yes! Ooh, nice jumps. Bring the purple tomatoes for flavor. Yeah. Add a bit more seasoning. Oh. Now he's just spitting the bad stuff. 
Peppers. I'm just cleansing the soup of impurities. Or content, rather. It would have been fine. Throw a spit again. Drops the spit. What sort of planet is this guy from? Oh. You just keep jumping, though. Oh, yeah. Now you're making it hard for me. Oh! <laughs> Jeez, I, I really thought I had, had something there. Never mind. As long as he keeps doing it, I think we're okay. <laughs> we're literally just sliding between the gaps. We call ourselves a chef. We can't even ride the spit of a bird puking lava. Come on, yes! Yes! <laughs> you just stopped too, and we got him. <gasps> wow, last straw. Prepare for your last meal, bird. <laughs> you are the meal. Yeah! And we get dessert. <laughs> The things the bird spits is concerning. <laughs> oh, so true. Not a problem now. Now we're just gonna serve him to the people of the town. We don't know what he was made out of, but... Oh well. Bon appetit. Oh, capito. Well, that was fun. Now we can uh, see what's all changed a bit. We, we still gotta get souvenirs. Maybe get some more purple coins. There's definitely some stuff in the back area too. I do wanna check out. <laughs> Drinking the crow beer, yeah. <laughs> purple, oh, purple. Brown soda is purple beer. Also, this has gotta be for something, isn't it? Also, there's a, a moon on the salt pile. I shall steal all of them. Hey, hey, Goobas. Nice. Here, if you get down, we get up, and then... Juke! <laughs> Almost didn't work. Okay, what's this for, though? I feel like it's not for anything. <laughs> and we just did it for the sake of creating a giant tower. Yeah, we did. Okay. Good to know. Bye, Goombas. Wah! <laughs> Very tall group. We'll be back later. Thanks for tuning in. Thank to impress the lady Goomba. We already did that one though. And those are with different Goombas. So that's done. The hole in there. Oh, I guess I see that fire bro stuff. It's not a bad one. Yeah. It's like, it's funny because you see Fire Bros in this game before Hammer Bros. Because he saw one in uh, the Forest Kingdom. We just started seeing Hammer Bros, but these guys throw frying pans. So they're extra fun. <laughs> also, like, has the day at the bottom, November 5th. You know what, what day we're playing this on? How much longer do I want to play today? I don't know. Having fun. Not crazy longer because we're, we've been going for three hours, so. We'll still keep going. Um, in terms of next time we're playing this out, so, um, this upcoming weekend, I'm, I'm also busy, too. I'm going out of town for a little bit. Um, the following weekend, though, maybe we could do more. Something maybe for that meantime. It's not an exact schedule, but when we do play, it's going to be on weekends. Usually, uh, maybe every other-ish. Always let you guys know at least a few days in advance on Discord. Maybe, so I got my dates right, let's... I can see about next weekend, but uh, I'll post it a few days in advance in the Discord for sure. So. It's possibly one of the days, uh, not next weekend, but the following, either the Saturday or Sunday. And then I'll probably post the bots to YouTube too, for people wanting to watch them there. <laughs> Should the Hammer Bros be called Pan Bros then? Yeah! Frying Pan Man. <laughs> Okay. Oh, it's one of these switch islands. At least the center's always stay. 
It's not an instant kill. Oh. Nice. <laughs> Stumped him. Oh. We gotta be careful, though. Just taking this very dangerously. They'll be going on them when they all go down. Uh, oh, that's an even one. Where's the final? Oh, of course, there's a moon behind there. <laughs> Crafty. Trying to take my hat. <laughs> Kick him off. Because yeah, next time we stream, we'll definitely be doing the finale. <laughs> I don't know, this shot just has great energy to it. How can I pass up on that? <laughs> also me, how do I get the good angle? <laughs> that one for the sake of, yeah, being very funny. <sighs> oh, what the hell is this? <laughs> Sorry, had to do that one. Some filters are neat, I just don't have a good application. Maybe that one, and then we'll go a little zoomed out. I oh, when he's near center, it looks pretty good. <laughs> Me being uh, critical here. So I have to get the good shots. I, I, I like taking shots in this kingdom. It's just so vibrant. And the one with the coin? Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> uh, the scrubbing is a little too fine. Wait. That one's better. Yeah. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, right. <laughs> We're in the middle of action, weren't we? And we lost our special coin. Okay. Now we should go around. I see here's a safe way. I live dangerously, though. It's better than the Mona Lisa. Thank you. My expert photographer skills. <laughs> Not really. I, I'm a bad photographer. I'm just getting lucky right now with the shots. I'm laying it up well. I don't know. Like, thinking of, like, exact positioning on the fly isn't my thing. Like, if I was, like, edited a picture, like, it's, like, sure. But, like... I'm not a good, like, natural photographer at all. We're we'll taking stupid photos. That has, like, a ton of, like, extra top or side room that doesn't need. I feel like I'm getting better, though. It is definitely a skill, though. It can be. To take the best ones. Whoa. Back and forth? Yeah. That's it. Okay. Oh, they're falling gradually, aren't they? Oh, just, well, just one. <laughs> I guess it's probably harder if you just run it. We we took our crafty route. Okay, get the hat back sooner. Yeah, this part opened up because I think it was like blocked off or something. I don't think there's anything more here. Yeah, it was just that. What area has a lot of stuff missed? I think back underneath the meat plateau, there's some stuff we missed. Oh, yeah, he's cooking up carnival. Gonna put it all into the upcoming carnival. So, you know, some eggs? I don't know what he's cooking over. <laughs> I guess just the hot climate. Hot stuff. <laughs> Bacon. Mm. Ah. Hey, this little piece of meat. That's gonna be your big chance to strut our stuff. <laughs> Wait, is Mario like salivating at the food? <laughs> he's crying over it. He's he's so happy. Love that. <laughs> See that? It didn't take me ten years that time. Up with the great meat plateau. It is pretty great. I'll give you that one. Also, there's food now. It's like the chunky ends of the meats. Oh no, oh, I was trying to burn him alive. <laughs> Revenge. Wait, did we go through that door? 
me not remembering really quick. Uh, for some reason, I think I saw it and then we didn't. Uh-oh. Hopefully, I'm not just backtracking for no reason. I remember the other ones, though. Not this one. Damn it. We might have. There's a lot of doors like that. Oh, we did it! It's Cheese Land! Hello. Ah! No! Don't sink me to the abyss of Cheese Land. Break them all! Yeah! Woo -hoo. Love the frying pan. Pan, bro. Oh, apparently it was under there. Good to know. Kill a spiny soon. <laughs> Our revenge now. Oh, haha. <laughs> Oops. I love the run and jump music. A little spranky. Goodbye, crunchy cheese. This cheese isn't good. It's not from Wisconsin. So much crunch. <laughs> uh. <laughs> There's still two more? What do you mean? <laughs> Breaking this for millennia. Ah, okay. There is another. <laughs> You know, movie doesn't bounce, so. I love my boost by bouncing. Because it makes sense, like how they always just like bounce up and down. So, I'll give that to him. Oh, it's all the way up there. Oh, wait, there's a hidden moon. I think it's that though. I feel like we kind of broke our window maybe a bit. Wait, maybe, maybe not, maybe not. Maybe, okay. <laughs> We can't get much further. We'll, we'll have to re-enter the sub area for that. Yeah. Sometimes it just happens. Wait, maybe not. This is risky. No. <laughs> okay. We'll have to re-enter. That's, that's quick and simple. And where's this final... Oh, you know, there's like a little block right there. It's probably just stupidly under there. It can't be up there. <gasps> Come on. Make this hunt difficult. It's Oh, it's in a pet, of course. <laughs> One of the few patches we didn't check. It's a crafty hidden one, though. <laughs> Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Heal up. <laughs> At least convenient in that sense. Just full health. Excavate and search the cheese rocks. Now we gotta build a little staircase of such. <laughs> oh, you can just walk it pretty much right off the bat. Good to know. Yeah. Climb the cheese rocks. Cool. Now behind the meat plateau. Oh, wait. There's a door to the side and also a bunch of coins up there. See, I knew this back area was not very well looted. Nice. 85? We're doing that good? We can buy like all the souvenirs. We will have to, for sure. Oh, it was just a uh, little treasure room. How neat. I think we got, all the we got all the turnips from earlier. I think it's only three. It'll probably, uh, we'll do this kingdom, just for whatever here, and then uh, we'll save the rest for um, the next time we play. Because uh, there's like, Technically, only three kingdoms after this, and one of them's really small. So, we'll save those three for, uh, yeah, our next stream. Which that entails a finale, too. Which I'm excited for. It's a very good finale. It's, like, still one of my favorite game finales, like, ever. Just the pure energy of it's amazing. Uh... 
Uh, wow, I almost fell off. Wait, what's here? Is that... Oh, it's a secret moon. Cool. Crossing to the magma. Maybe it'll get closer to full purple coins. I'm just glad we have enough for the souvenirs. The painter off its cool. I, I rarely ever use it. Though. Especially when you're here, it's like you gotta go chef mode. 88? You know, that's pretty impressive that we're, you know, like nine tenths done. Circle. There's a neat one. Nothing too fancy, nothing too dry. Okay. Yeah. What's everyone's favorite outfit in Odyssey? Nice maneuvering, thank you. Because I think, okay, the chef one's just up there because I like the chef one a lot. Um, I also really dig, it's hard. I think Explore is pretty fun. Um, but I also really just like the top hat one from that kingdom and also the uh, just like the city goer one that corresponds to uh, New Donk City. I think those are all cool. I feel like I'm forgetting one that's really cool. And plus I never saw all the DLC ones too. Um, I know the DLC added a bunch of ones that you get post game, but I don't know all of them. I can't wait to get all those though. It's something good to spend our coins on too. So can't argue with that. The shop Mario? Oh, like the classic one? Or are you talking about a different one? Oh, that was not a smart idea. Let's go back. <laughs> Somewhat. Uh-oh. Bye-bye. Oh, the purple and yellow one. Oh, yeah. The crazy cap one. That one's silly. We didn't really wear it yet, but we did buy it. There's a way we can get to the back one. Is it just through here? Thought I saw a wall, but also... Let me just get a peek. Yeah, let's do that back sub-area. So I think we can just warp to... Oh. We'll do top so we can get a vantage point. I think that'll be kind of nice. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> jeez. Nice. Uh, is this? Yeah, we can do this. It's another back and forth race. As if it's a challenge for us. Oh, nice. <laughs> yeah. Back flip. Nobody you tilt it, but I guess we got a very high jump there. So many moons. 38. Okay. Oh, I see Captain Tilt over there. We got to make that our... Uh, Last bang for this kingdom. Mm. Is there a bubble somewhere? I guess there was up there. Oh, nice. <laughs> Tricky shot into the mouth. And there's this guy. Oh, nice. Uh, uh. <laughs> Let's get the bubbles up there. And then take that to Captain Toad. We, we went to the wrong one, didn't we? Yeah. But it happens. It happens. Okay. Uh. Yeah, I think you just gotta kind of break free. Ah! Bleh. <laughs> Next time we'll go a bit further out than break free. Whoop. <laughs> okay. Captain Toad. Hello. No more lava bubble. Sizzle time, right? Spice. Okay, 39th moon. I'll say it's a pretty good spot. 
Bon Appetit, Captain Toad. Okay. No, I feel comfortable leaving off there. So, uh, thank you. You know what? Next time we'll do the last three kingdoms. Uh, <laughs> Hi, Captain Toad. Literally just for the funny factor. Yeah, why not? <laughs> I don't know. I just like taking silly screenshots. I'll, I'll uh... We'll show a few of them. Yeah. <laughs> Having a good time. Wait, that one's better. Yeah. Ah! <laughs> the Goom Bros. Yeah. And, uh... Me looking at the Goom Bros. And <laughs> just... Spicy. Just every planet's so hot. Or every area of the planet's so hot in this. Besides the snow. It's very funny. What we took last time. So yeah. <laughs> At least we got the best kingdom done first. Yeah, that was fun. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so seaside, a little bit of like today in Ness. And it was very fun. So next time we stream, which... Um, yeah. We'll be, be busy next weekend, but the following weekend will probably be either free Saturday or Sunday. One or the other. And... I'll announce it a few days in advance in the Discord, um, but we'll go live one of those days, finish up the last couple kingdoms. Two main ones, one very small one. Uh, but it'll be exciting, so thank you guys. We will save up right here. Great photography. <laughs> yes. Okay. Yeah, in the meantime, uh, next stream will be uh, Wednesday on YouTube, uh, Breath of the Wild. So I'll see you guys there. I'm working on some other projects, and uh, can't wait for more of this too. So thanks for tuning in. Hope you have a good one. Bye-bye.